and and we're all here and we're all we're all visible and we should all be heard hello guys grab the fucking queen of hearts and throw her in the lake hey happy birthday luna thanks like i like swimming but not that much yeah, I didn't say happy birthday yet. Happy birthday. <laughs> Thank happy you. Birthday. You got this before this dog. Um... And hello, everyone who's in. Hello, Nisset. And hello, uh, Faro. I hope you're all doing good. I'm like reading it like, wait a second. These people are already with me. <laughs> I know these colors. So for anyone who's not familiar, you can uh, join the game by typing exclamation mark join and you'll be assigned a random noble court. Uh, and if you have the game yourself, you can choose exactly which noble court you're in. Oh my, Silver, speak of the devil. Hello, Sil, thank you for stopping in, and hello, Copy. Oh yeah, we, we were totally not talking about artists behind their back. We, we wouldn't do that. I would never scheme. Certainly not. It Praise not someone who isn't nature. there? That's That's oh. weird. <laughs> no, I will say to your face, Silver, your art is gorgeous, and you should praise yourself more for the amazing work that you put forth in spite of your own self-deprecation. You know, you didn't... You know that it just makes an artist implode. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Sil, woke up and you chose violence. <laughs> I've been feeling in. like I need to throw up for the past few mornings. I am constantly choosing violence. You know, fair enough. I, I know that experience. <laughs> also, thank you, Hilbert. <laughs> oh. And thank you, Eyes. Hi, I'm so glad so many people could make it. <laughs> Speaking of choosing violence, chat. Just a reminder, one of the opening ceremonies can be to throw the queen in the river. Can be. We, yeah. we could do that. And thank you for the follow. But first, people gotta join in. Um, I think as the game goes, you can... I, I, I don't remember if you can join halfway through. But I want to wait till like, there's at least a bunch of people in. I'm pretty uh, sure you can. Oh. Oi. Oh. Hi, Ice. Right. That... No. <laughs> Thank you so much for the for the five subs. That it's so sweet of you. Good morning. Just dropped a bunch of birthday gifts on the yeah, table. Yeah, like just just came in, dropped the gifts, and sat down. <laughs> like hi. <laughs> Happy birthday, yeah, throws a fucking bundle of money at your face. <laughs> <laughs> See, this is the reason I, I want to uh, get like a Twitch integrated throwing system. I just, I have to like figure it out and like set it up. I don't know how difficult it is. Oh, it's, it's really simple. easy. Okay, yeah. I should get like, onto once, that then. Once you get your hands on it, it's super simple. Like, the, the only thing that I would say is not easy about it is the fact that it sometimes acts like a diva and, like, scuffs, but, meh. Yeah. And Twitch chat on stream, it looks frozen, like, yeah. sometimes the connection to your system can be a bit finicky, but you can also... Like, I use it even when I do PNG, right? So that, like, I'll just be vibing and be a PNG, and it will still throw shit at me. I don't... Can you set up the PNG to swap um, status? Like, change the um, expression when you get hit? That would be amazing. I don't know that that... Like, I I would have to ask my programmer friends for that. Actually, oh. wasn't Copy in the chat? Copy yeah, was in the chat. Here. Copy. Uh, yeah, sorry, I'm like... Oh, you're right. The... the Chat on stream does seem frozen, but I don't know how to fix that right now. I, I guess that is our mandatory scuff of the, the day. The chat will just uh, not work. Try try refreshing the source. Yeah, that, that can work. Yeah. Um, what are you using for your chat widget? I um, am using 
uh, what you called? Oh, Come yeah, on, brain. Stream so elements. Much more organized than ah. me. Oh yeah, Luna is super organized. Yeah, I showed her how my stuff is laid out, and <laughs> <laughs> I once showed her our art folders, and I thought she she got a heart attack. <laughs> Uh, then you will remind me later to show you my OBS, and I want to see those art folders. Because <laughs> I live for the chaos. Like... Oh, wait, I just remembered. I just remembered something fun. There's a, um... There's a line that I've recently been workshopping in my head for one of my vampire clans. The one that I will probably end up in myself. Mm -hmm. Um, namely, it's simply, um, treachery is in our nature, darling. Did you think you would escape it just by being close to me? Hmm. Chaos is a disease, Luna is the cure. I don't think I'm that organized yet. <laughs> <laughs> Not that- You have named- Each of your nested scenes has brackets, NS, and brackets. Yes, nested scene. Exactly. <laughs> Everything is labeled. The only thing you're not doing is color coding your fucking things. And Can you color code them? Like, this was oh, what I was about to job. say! <laughs> I was about to say the only reason you're not doing it is because you don't know you can! You can color code them. <gasps> <laughs> You are joining um, King of the Castle, and yes. therefore can then throw me in the river. Basically, if you join, you can just type in join, and then whenever things come up, like decisions to be made, uh, you'll be able to type in chat and change stuff. Also, hi, Will. I don't think I said hi yet. I think Luna I... is today's today's queen, and uh, Vizzy Martin and I are her court. Uh, every one of us kind of presiding over one of the regional groups, although we don't really have like much of a uh, actual power to enforce things. We just there. can like talk to you hey, guys me, about what we works. think mm. okay. might that be good to work for. Also, hi Slime, yeah. thank you for stopping by. <laughs> okay, that's that's a slight predicament. What, 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 what is that? What are you doing? <laughs> So I I realized I was using the th wrong thing for the for the reactive. I was using the simply open one instead of the the talking one. Mm -hmm. Uh and the the gif one is smaller. <laughs> yes, yeah. you have all the open air. Hold up. Yeah, use the gif one. I'll I'll size you up again. You can just yeah. change the yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, I you just, just need to f fix all of these. And for some reason, like my things are not showing up properly okay speaking image inactive image yeah i think you got your speaking your inactive switched up right now again <laughs> rest 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 yes yeah right now i'm a ventriloquist <laughs> in my settings uh no i i was just about to say you got you guys want to see the new confetti because a certain someone in chat provided me with new birthday confetti. Ooh. Confetti upgrade. Confetti upgrade. This is not... Ah! Whoa! <laughs> Ooh. It looks cool, doesn't it? That's it's some big. good confetti. Hell yeah. Will made it for me. Nice. Okay, I, I should be all good now. Yeah, let me just... Secretly go to the yeah, lounge like... to adjust you there too, so you're not a very tiny boy. Yeah, I need to be at least able to, like, give Martin a peck on the nose. I know I'm not gonna outscale him. But... Yeah, he is taller. <laughs> he is. Like if um... you if you go if you go tippy toes, it should be okay. <laughs> if I go my tippy toes, if I just get some higher heels and go my tippy toes, I might be able to. Like, at least be on head height with him. You guys, by the way, want to see, like, the game game? Or do you guys want to see the uh, the OBS window? I would prefer the game game, so I can actually read what's on screen. Yeah. That might be yeah. a good idea, yeah.
that do it? No. Okay. Well, this and then there. Ah, and the music. I get protogen. Let's go. Protogen. We shall. We shall con con collude. Is that the word I'm looking for? Hold on. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, no, no, <laughs> no, 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 no colluding here. Everyone in chat ready? Everyone who wanted to type in join, join. I mean, how are you? I love this game. I'm, I'm well. I'm nervous, but I'm, I'm, I'm excited. We shall collude and make our plans. Is there a way to change where we are in the game? And they are also in the way of the third option. Um, as in, in which like uh, group you join? Unless you have the game yourself, no. Basically, it'll just put you in whichever one needs filling. Unless you like type in join and then the name of the uh, group. Um, and and you can only like purposely change that if you have the game yourself. So you don't need to have the game to play, but if you do have it, you can customize how you'll look and you can decide exactly which court you'll be in. I think I've joined. Yeah, you seem yeah, to be in the partition. You're, you're over here at my place. Once again, I've been busy with work lately, but I will not miss Luna's birthday stream. It it is really appreciated that you come by to say hi. That that goes for anyone. That makes me really happy. I guess we'll just get started and as other people come in they can they can join too. Go. Let's do this. <clears throat> okay, you guys might be slightly I I've forgotten that this is the side where there there are the numbers. Hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> we we can we can scoot down a little bit. It's... Yeah, I guess I need to scoot you guys down a little. Uh, like so and also for some reason it seems that the... oh yeah the the resolution oh, yeah. like the, the yeah oh you're slightly ratio off is weird yeah side. just hold up usually my screen to the side is kind of small so adjusting that it's a little difficult by okay um oh also chat um you should be able to activate or open up a an extension on Twitch, um, on on the on the stream itself, uh, that lets you see once you've joined your personal wealth at the moment and your uh, the region you've joined. Not I should don't be better. Have to relearn everything, but this is fine. We are here to be menaces, chat, and. The studious uh, bulwark against the Eastern Sea. No extension on the stream. Wait, no extension. In the top left. Yeah, yeah I, I, I'm, 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 I'm for sure right turned it on. Uh, I can see it, so it works yeah, in Sweden. Yeah, it might not be available on the phone. I don't know how extensions on the phone work. I'm not available on the phone. Oh. Uh -huh. We should at least now be able to see things, and I don't know how it would work when you're on the phone. I guess you'll just have to guess. <laughs> um, let's go to the council introduction. So, who wants to read one? I know that, like, um, for each of the um, courts, it makes sense that you, like, each of you read the respective uh, people from those. So I guess I'll do everything else. That would make sense. Okay. I mean, does, does someone of us want to be the chancellor? To make it easier on Luna? Uh, do either of you want to do it? Otherwise, I can try and make a, ca a chancellor voice. I mean... Go wild! Yeah, go yeah, for let it. Me, let me stand up my desk first. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh, you know, these guys have probably got to come back a lot, right? <laughs> okay, here's the question, chat. Do we make kindly old gentlemen or really fucking flamboyant? I That's like the two vibes I get from this guy. I mean, do you want to use the flamboyant one for the, <laughs> for the... 
for like the counts or because I feel like the counts are also gonna be flamboyant, so Oh yeah, that's true. You guys want him flamboyant? I wonder wait, hold on, I get it. Let's see if we can't combine the two. Yes, surely it's possible. You know that works. <laughs> I like that one. Alright. Now you're the queen. Slay, <laughs> your first duty is to meet with the Council of Nobles. Your nobles hail from all across the kingdom. The wi the wintry north, the desolate east, and of course, the wealthy coast. Hey, it's Lime! Good luck in the days ahead, your greatness. You'll need it dealing with us lot. Thanks for the warning. Your aunt, an honor to finally make your acquaintance, your majesty. May you escape the doom that befell your predecessor. Thanks! <laughs> A pleasure, your esteemed highness. I hope to see your kingdom prosper and grow wealthy under your reign. Thank you. The council hall immediately fills with raised voices as the nobles argue with each other and demand your favor. You sigh and sit back. Is this what the council is like? No wonder your father told you to avoid the throne at all costs. It wasn't, be <laughs> it wasn't because he, he knew that he was going to get murdered and didn't want that for you. He wasn't murdered. He had an accident. Yes, an accident. Let's go to our coronation, shall we? Your Majesty, I've scheduled your coronation to take place in a week's time. Uh, shouldn't I be giving the orders now? Of course, Your Majesty. Also, um, restless. And when nobles get restless, they take their daggers and look for the nearest back. Oh, uh, great. Or backside. <laughs> We wouldn't want that, I suppose. As is tradition, the council will decide what happens at your coronation. But, but it's my coronation! This isn't an absolute monarchy, your majesty. Everything has to be run past the council vote, even this. Shall we call the nobles in? Well, guys, your first vote. <laughs> Oh, hey. Royalty is very accident prone. You can't vote Re yet. Oh, oh whoops. Okay, whoops. wait, 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 wait. <laughs> um. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Oh. I had to put a different message because I can't put the same thing twice. Oh, there we go. My bad, I thought- I mean, really, is easy. there a choice? Like, like if you're you honest here, yeah. <laughs> Grab the fucking really... queen by the neck and throw her in there. I, you need to do exclamation mark vote and then your vote, guys. Oh. Luckily, Slime's got you guys covered. But <laughs> I just realized, wait a second, you guys aren't showing up. Yeah. Slime had you guys covered already, but... There we go. And to the river I go. I do like swimming, but not this much. What kind of coronation should be held for the queen? To the river! <laughs> it is decided. The queen shall be thrown in the river. I've played and hosted this a multiple of times. <laughs> then you are the most, like, <laughs> advantaged of us all. <laughs> Let me get changed out of my nice robes. <laughs> no changing. Oh, you <laughs> the nobles pick you up and carry you out to, to the Treadwater River, hurling you into the shallow water with a cheer. When you climb back up the bank, soaking wet, the Chancellor steps forward and places the crown upon your head. Is it your imagination, or are some of the nobles sti stifling giggles? No, I think they're most definitely giggling. Listen, it's an ancient tradition. We are coastal to the kingdom. We gotta, like... Anyone want to play the spy master? Or should should I read for the spy master? I do like her sure. having a burp. Yeah, you want to do it? Your Majesty. When you die, how do you hope the kingdom will remember you? 
I just got coronated. What kind of morbid question is this? Yeah, well, fuck. We all have to be prepared for the inevitable. Hmm. The fucking count in the background just filing their nails. Just. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we all want the country to prosper. We just want some parts of the country to prosper more than others. <laughs> Oh, that would be the count, but would be the coastals, not us. Hmm, yeah. We just want science! Hmm. Mm hmm. Hmm. Planning your tactic. I see yeah, I'm, I'm thinking about this. I think I'll go for stability. Mm hmm. An admirable aim. I suggest, over the next few years, you focus on improving the kingdom's stability as much as possible. Once you have an heir, I will return to discuss how your ambition is progressing. Good luck, your majesty. Thanks, I'm gonna need it, I think. <sighs> End the season. Yoda of the De Silver Clan, notorious Northern or orator, stands precarious on a lighthouse, lighthouse crossbeam, screaming like a fallen god. Ah! <laughs> ah, it's a Scandinavian longhouse. <laughs> Chief of the North, we all know I should be on the throne, not the imposter Queen Luna Floors. How do we make that happen? Dang. Well, guys, how are you going to make it happen? Oh. Oh, uh... This one is a vote exclusively for the chiefs. Yeah. All, all chief people, vote. I'm gonna go for C. Let's lower all faith. I love the music. That's fair, Proto. Can I? I can make more feminine voices, but they are certainly not my forte. Well, I guess Martin is the only one who chose. <laughs> You're the as sole opposed, leader. <laughs> as opposed to the actual kingdom, the northern clans <laughs> is an absolute monarchy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was playing Senless and didn't have time. It, it's okay. I'm sorry if you, this isn't what you wanted, though. The Chiefs plan to dig up Od oh, God, that word. Odelg's legendary home and use it to take over the kingdom. First, they must win the favor of the gods by diminishing the kingdom's belief in the ninth. Yeah, yeah, I, that is what I'm worried about. They are already at zero faith. To advance our schemes, the Chief must lower the combined total of Origin's faith to 12 or less in four seasons. Oh! Y you're already there. Oh, dear. I have four seasons to keep it there. Oh boy. Hello, Alicia. Hello. Tenny, you want to do this one? Or should I do like all of the, like... Um, you, you do the narrator? Yeah, sure. Or... Cyril of the Willcraft family, eccentric former pirate, scribbles with a well-used quill on a hardwood desk, muttering in frustration. Fellow patricians of the coast, my claim to the throne is far more legitimate than that of Queen Luna Force. Something must be done. Voting time. Voting time. What we gonna do? Ooh, ooh we can do sorcery. We, we can do sorcery. That would be a new one for us, I think. Yeah, I don't think... I don't think... I've seen sorcery before. I think the, uh, the counts did it last time. Yeah, but I believe the kind of sorcery between the between the guys is different. I believe. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's why I'm interested. Magic it is. Hey, look at how you look, Will. I Ooh. I love the patricians. I like their masks, and also they're basically Dutch. They're they're like coastal traders. <laughs> they're basically Dutch. <laughs> I'm, I'm I have no of... idea where 
I don't know what to... I think you ended up on the Nords? Yeah, I think when I when I played last, I ended up at the North. No, no, no. I mean, uh, uh, um, Alicia joined. Oh, um, Alicia, do you have do you have are you uh, bleh, 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 sorry words? Are you online on browser like on desktop uh, computer? You are on the North. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. I can also check for you. <laughs> Why the hell does the North get all the people? Yeah, I it. Don't... No. Should try to evenly disperse them, so I don't know what's up with that. It's as they say, Scotland forever. <laughs> I was just excited to get Alicia on my team. What the fuck? <laughs> Revolution. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The patricians <laughs> plan to make a bargain with a wizard. These immortal spellcasters seldom get involved in political squabbles, but perhaps if the queen was considered a threat to their autonomy... To advance their scheme, the patricians must raise authority to five or more in two seasons. I mean, um... Alicia, if you, if you might want to like vote for our stuff anyway, that's that's completely fine by me. Like, you can you can vote still in favor of the patricians when it comes to stuff. It's it's fine. Nobody's stopping you. Very true. <laughs> Vladina of the Protogen Pharaoh dynasty, dynasty, sinister Eastern progeny, progeny, leans delicately on a podium, sighing. Okay, uh, Perdita, I, I'll put it up to you if you want me to try and voice it, or if you want to leave it to one of the gals. I mean, technically, it's of the dynasty. So it's yeah. not literally them, it's it's their dynasty. Let's see here. My fellow counts. In ancient times the East was its own proud kingdom. We can bring those days of glory We can bring back those days of glory. But not while the false Queen Luna wears the crown. The patricians have hot fish people living in their waters, true. Wait, what? <laughs> There, there are, I'm pretty sure, mer mermaids. I might have chosen the wrong team. <laughs> You're the vampires now. Stop complaining. Okay, <laughs> splash, splash. Ascension. Ascension? I don't think we've seen that one before. Ah, oh, yes. Lower your faith, please. Yeah, actually, don't. You know, <laughs> how have you um, considered... Um, Doing I not that. Like possession. Oh. Oh, did it go through? Only. Oh, only, only. Wait, can you guys still vote? Oh, that's interesting. Also, still, you are. Still, you're on the the, the chief, so you can't vote for this one. Only the counts of the east can vote. Magic and fish people. Yeah, I'm on the right team. <laughs> I vote for the revolution. And they said, I don't think you have joined yet. So you got to join first before you can vote. Exclamation mark, join, and then you can also put in a pronoun. Yeah. If you want to be specific. Uh, pronoun, or if you just want to leave it up to the hands of fate. Yes, hands of fate. Chief of the Norths get a fifth member. <laughs> <laughs> so funny. I think oh, you no, have to hey, do she. On the... hey. hey, it's starting to. Oh, look at you. Hey. We may be few, but that just means concentrated power. <laughs> we may only be two of us, but just That's the one two left. of you. <laughs> hey, Proto, just the two of us. You we can, can make, make it, it if we try. try, just the two of us. I wanted Lunar Martin for my voice if I'm either dude just or chick. We'll try and keep that in mind, but Go like... With French from time to time, just <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> you and I. We'll try and keep that in mind. Because like, there's some... Sometimes you'll have characters that will be of your like, dynasty. And sometimes there will be like, characters that are you. And it'll switch that up. If we if we see 
oh, if we okay. see this picture, then either me or Martin, I think I, they're they them, so could be either of us. Concentrated I, power, I can just bite your ankles, <laughs> that is a valid strategy. Okay, Alicia. Just, just make it depending on the situation, like which other conversation partners are in there. Yeah. Lower faith, huh? Yeah. Hmm. The no, Count's just, like... plan to induct the Queen into their secret <laughs> cult and offer her immortality in exchange for the throne. First, they must reduce the power of the Eastern Church. To advance their scheme, the Counts must lower their fate to four or less in three seasons. So, they're already there. So, I really need to get you guys some faith. I need to bring you guys to church. Churches are Big painful. Good I worship like a dog at the shrine of my life. <laughs> hey, quick question. Yeah. Oh, authority is that one over there. Okay, I, I see, I see, I see. Everything's yeah. fine. No, yeah. no questions. Your Majesty, these upstarts are saying they have a right to your throne. No doubt the nobles are already scheming to crown their region's preferred claimant. I have no heir. And so I need to raise faith, I need to raise faith, and I need to keep authority not too high. Oh yeah, you wanna you wanna go down on authority? You want no authority? No, I need to just keep it stable. You, you want you want no authority? You want rebellion? We can we can do I, we can I'm do fairly that sure there is someone who's in, <laughs> who's excited about that idea. Y'all need lunar Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> where's where's that emote? Hold up, I need to I need to post a certain emote in the chat. Ooh, after voting, nobles can change their mind and vote for a different option. You just have that. Yes. Okay. Cool. Unless cool. very, very emotes practically are amazing. <laughs> <laughs> I am concerned. I plan, right? You guys know that you guys are nobles too, right? See, here's the thing. If the threat of a guillotine is on the table, immortality does sound quite appealing, does it not? You make a point, but also you you never specified what kind of immortality it was. Oh, we can work out the fine details later. <laughs> yeah, just imagine we chop off Luna's head and then suddenly the head is still alive and talking. That kind exactly. of immortality. <laughs> yeah, that seems very unpleasant. You become very portable and easy to transport across your entire realm. I don't want to be portable. <laughs> I like being in my house and wait, not leaving. Wait, do you have quote command in your chat? I unfortunately do not, as yeah. far as I know. I need to help you add that because that is an amazing fucking quote. I don't want to be portable. Hi, Stormby, <laughs> welcome in. Thank you so much for the raid. It's been a while. I hope you've been doing Welcome good. Raiders. Hello. Please, please join me in Tentacle. We need more people in our courts because um, the Chiefs of the North are uh, a bit plentiful right now. Oh yeah! Exclamation mark! Join if you also want to help shape the way this kingdom will go. <laughs> if you want to plot against my demise, <laughs> join oh. them. <laughs> I don't want your demise, darling. No, 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 no. We're we're loyal, loyal court members. We we just want the best mm -hmm. for the kingdom. Exactly, and I even want the best for you. Have you heard about youth serums? Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Lopdal. Hello, everyone. I'm the birthday child. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming in. If you have to raid and run because you need to eat, sleep, or do other things, then please go take care of yourselves. But if you can stay, we'd love to have you here. These streets certainly would love to have you to collude against me. And yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. For once, I'm not colluding against you. I'm colluding for you. Mm-hmm. Let's look at the whole honor guard. I think you could use some guards. <laughs> You also need to romance your pirate girlfriend. I do need to romance the pirate queen. Ah. Anyone wants to play the marshal or shall I uh, go for the marshal? I I'll think Martin's got the voice for it, yeah. 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 Try think of... Uh... Try 
I think I'm a good voice for that. Hold on. Thank you for the follow, Senzura. <laughs> okay, I got it. As is tradition, each region offers a select of elite guards. The chiefs were their most favourite warrior heroes. The counts were knights of the Order of the Drow Ro Drowned Rose. And the part 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 bleh, the patricians, I nearly said partitions, <laughs> and the patricians offer their great gladiators champions of the arena. We do participate. <laughs> True. They also do that. <laughs> and you also part my, my head from my body if you get the chance. No, no, no. Also, hi, Doodle. Thank you for coming in. And you will be randomly assigned. Unless you have the game yourself, then you can choose. Um, but otherwise, it will randomly assign you to one of the, uh, like, three options. And usually, and it seems you've joined the Count of the Lords. Oh, my goodness gracious. Wow. Is oh, it because wait. I have two nobles? I, I was going to ask. Is it because yeah. of the two... Yeah. It no. might be genuinely because of the two nobles. It it might be that it's like yeah, slightly maybe. leaning more towards this, but they generally try to this like huh. divide it really evenly. Is, I suggest a truce between the two of us I, to get no. the fucking northerners. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, we can't recruit the northern warriors. There's been a major scandal. They got drunk and burned in a church of the ninth. <laughs> Speaking of the northerners <laughs> being. <laughs> Scott's getting drunk and causing <laughs> property damage? Never! <laughs> Burning down churches of religions and like stealing your stuff? Hmm. <laughs> that never I happens. Volunteer. I totally volunteer. Not Scotland. I'm a patrician at heart. They won't come to the capital until this blows over. You'll need to pick someone else. Okay. The Order of the Drowd Rose are highly rep uh, respectable. They'll understand pl a palace etiquette, but it's been years since they fought an actual battle. Hmm. They mostly write poems these days. <laughs> it's an art form. <laughs> yeah, I kind of need you to be guards, though. Our battle will be legendary starts to diss them. Slam poetry. <laughs> Vizzy just grumbling from his writing desk in the corner, like in the dark. In the you didn't like, need to call me up. What the fuck? Wait, no. They're right. No. My immortal playing in the back. Fuck. I assume Among Us isn't happening this stream since I saw no notification about it in the server. No. We didn't have enough people, so it's it'll just be um, the king of the castle. And good morning, trans rights. Thank you so much for stopping by. Our battles will be legendary. <laughs> okay, what about the coastal gladiators? A gang of lowborn crooks who have turned themselves into celebrities through their skills at chopping other people to bits. Mm -hmm. Vain and selfish. Yeah, real partitioning uh, going on there, huh? Their skills in battle is undeniable, but can So what about the foreign mercenaries? <laughs> A band of fearsome fighters from the t uh, Taterlands called the Battle Bitten Brethren. That is certainly a name. Tater lens. I can only imagine they farm a lot of potatoes. They're Irish. <laughs> <laughs> Please, as well, God, don't hire these people. <laughs> but come on! Light it I need a tater. Light it I need Kill a fucking Englishman and throw him in the sea. Wait. <laughs> They're English. That's a different story. The question no, is, am I English? Story. Oh, is it? Yeah, no, there's a guy who just decided, like, apparently in two weeks he made a emo song and he made an Irish, like, battle song, which love I that. love the description. That's the definition of rage. Oh. They specialize just... in bodyguard. Oh, sorry. No, I'll send you the thing later. Go on. Please do. They specialize in bodyguard work, but they're costly. And hiring foreigners will show a lack of confidence in your kingdom's fighters. Well, yeah, you see, I am not confident in the kingdom's <laughs> fighters. Hmm. I have the money. But you're gonna hire the BBB. <laughs> I 
I await your verdict with bated breath, your majesty. Okay. Mar Martin won my vote with the maid dress. Oh, God, I forgot. <laughs> it's in my channel trailer. <laughs> I mean, hey, maid dress killed potato potato. Team, yeah. <laughs> That was either going to get approval or the absolute disdain. <laughs> it's interesting that the uh, Northerners don't have a... Yeah, they, they aren't allowed to be chosen because they burned out a church. <laughs> I do not have that option. Yeah, like one time. <laughs> you burned out one church. You know, I'll... Last time did it. The first one's free, right? Hmm? The first one was free, right? <laughs> yeah, you see, I don't think it was their first. <laughs> if you don't count the last one, the one you're doing is always the first. I was zoning I... out for a moment and I came back to, I don't think it's their first. And my brain is not Burn responsible. Down church. <laughs> I think... It would not be my first. I think I will choose the partitions because I'm not sure I want someone people that read poems. I think I want people that can fight. Ah, yes, yes, yes. It might have been a mistake, but we'll find out. No, 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 no. They're they're, they're very, very trained and very, very oily. The gladiators arrive a few weeks later. The men are bare-chested and women are underdressed, eager to show off their bodies as much as their weaponry. They gather behind your throne and begin oiling themselves up. Ayo. As I said. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you know what? I can approve of them. It's 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 a practical <laughs> choice to help. <laughs> they what? Protect protect against grappling. <laughs> <laughs> Your esteemed highness, a blacksmith in the coast, has come up with some sort of printing contraption. Oh. Instead of relying on painstaking effort of scribes, it produces a hundred copies of a text in an hour. How remarkable! Yes, your esteemed highness. Isn't technology wonderful? If you're agreeing with me, I'm immediately suspicious. <laughs> <laughs> Of course! Don't you see how dangerous this is? Books should stay in churches and universities. Or else commoners will start getting... ideas. You can't have the commoners thinking. <laughs> That'd oh, be bad. Uh, <laughs> They'd uh, realize... Ah uh, <laughs> uh, yes, a true noble. <laughs> They'd realize the numbers aren't adding up and people have been disappearing kind of for a while. Hold up, hold up. What kind of voice do you want? I can redo that in a voice that you you want. Oh, rile the people. <laughs> Alicia is plotting and scheming. Or warriors can skate across the battlefield by sliding forth in their oil trails. <laughs> <laughs> Just pingwing style. I'm still not over the fucking it protects against grappling. Yeah, yeah, it makes you slippery. Like, it makes sense. <laughs> but damn. I think we can move to the next text. Yeah. <laughs> you want democracy? That's how you get democracy. <laughs> Ghastly. Um... Oh my. Yeah, I think we should really, like, do do the folk a favor here. And, you know, knowledge. Come on now. Don't get with the time. Hmm. Remember, Counts, we want the faith low. Yeah, I don't want that. Same for the North, we also want faith low. I mean, the, I, a trade goes up. I'm not opposed to trade going up. Hmm. You know what? Oh, yeah, this Have fun. <laughs> See how well organized you are now. Did that go through? Yeah, it seems yeah, to have. Good, good, good. Yeah, free point through. Yes! <laughs> Knowledge! Power! Yeah, go ahead. Uh, See, chat? I'm using the fact that they don't read against them. Uh, <laughs> I turned in on reverse voting! No! <laughs> <laughs> I didn't see it! <laughs> 
curses. Get get gotten. How the turntables. Uh. Oh, huh. I get to break the tie as the monarch. I wonder what I'll choose. la di la di la Let's go for fate. Dang it. Northerners, we have you been played. What? That's okay, that Bamboos. doesn't make it worse for us. It will be my pleasure to take stewardship of this radical new invention. Over the next few months, the church pumps out thousands of new copies of the Ninth God's Holy Book. <laughs> Soon, every commoner owns one, even those who can't read. <coughs> ah, dang it. <coughs> Unfortunately, the church also prints countless pamphlets criticizing your rule and calling you a godless simpleton. <laughs> Gosh, uh. dang it. Ah. Okay. Oh, My stability went bad. down. That's not great. But hey, fate went up. So that that's nice. <laughs> I like that. Did your fart mm. go down? Hmm? Oh, hold on. Yeah, it's water down down the rub pipe. Your forties don't it free. Yeah, my oh. my authority went down. My stability also went down, unfortunately. But fate went up, so I blocked at least one uh, evil plan for now. Hmm. Come on, you you can't just call every plan we have an evil plan. You What's are so literally wanting to use a sorcerer against me. <laughs> we want to make we... you mortal. We wanted to bring knowledge to the people <clears throat> and strive for a better future. A risky wager. Oh, lovely. Hey, it's you. <clears throat> Hold onto your masks, hats, and other accessories, everyone. Count Vizi is about to lose a huge amount of money. Vizi? <laughs> <laughs> We've bet our life savings on a boat race around the coast, and I am sure to win the day. What did I tell you guys about wagering your life savings? <laughs> Do it. If they fail this, it's gonna be hilarious. <laughs> so sure, in fact, that I petitioned the council to officially sponsor my voyage. Ah? Huh? Ah? Huh? You want me to not only have you spend your life savings on it, you want me to Spend the kingdom's money on it. <laughs> a tiny bit of the kingdom's money, all of my money, a little bit of your money. Yeah. Oh, so you just because they're a sorcerer, that means they're evil. Hate speech. Cancel the queen. No, they want to set up the <laughs> sorcerer against me by lying to them. What makes you so sure? Eternal rain. Excuse me. We are from the co by all that glitters, your August Majesty. I'm a patrician. We practically learned to sail before we can walk. You see, see, it's good, good armor. Hashtag <laughs> cancel the queen. <laughs> well, there I go. <laughs> That's France nowadays. The new revolution. She's talking rubbish, your Majesty. Mm hmm. My nimble strug will easily be Tentacle's old boat. Oh, my name is not Vissy. If you sponsor anyone, sponsor me. Yeah, this scene sounds like a definitely don't get involved situation. <laughs> <laughs> but I guess I don't get that choice. Um. Well, why would I sponsor both nobles? I mean, you can absolutely decline. That is your prerogative, but. Yeah, I, I would love to if decline, you, but I don't think I have sponsor, a full... Sponsor... <laughs> if you sponsor both... Um... I mean, you you are practically betting on the winner. That is yeah. <laughs> if I sponsor you both, I basically give all of you money. Um... Also... Imagine... Imagine... How entertaining and flashy that race will be with more money. Yeah, I'm vetoing that option. Oh, come on! <laughs> I know what you guys want to do. Well, I get a feeling we're not going to win this, but unless, of course, the, okay, the, uh, the votes that were the North before that us. have to be made again. Yeah, you you have to wait until I I open the votes. I'm sorry for that. Uh, Will and, and yeah. Proto and Alicia. It's all tied. Oh. Oh, seems oh, Vizzy is gonna get sponsored. 
Oh my lord! Nope. No. <laughs> what happened at the end there? What? <laughs> I no think it doesn't drop the volume until Luna hits continue. Don't. Oh, don't someone worry. snuck in. It's all absolutely legitimate. And oh. <laughs> we didn't pay anyone off to get us both. <laughs> Dang. Just, just go. All right then. <laughs> what the hell? My Damn. humblest thanks, one and all. I'm honored to sail with the crown behind me. Yeah, you just took money from the royal treasury. <laughs> sure enough, a new figurehead is added to Tenkadel's little boat's prow that looks something like you. It has a crown, anyway. An art. Excitement builds as merchants and tourists flock to the starting town. Soon, both boats embark on their journey. They look very small and flimsy against the vast yeah. ocean backdrop. Your esteemed highness, I understand you elected to sponsor my fellow patrician for the race. Would you fancy a small wager? Since everyone says you're sure she'll win. What sort of wager? A mere trifle for you, I'm sure, your serene highness. Your wisdom is known by all, so naturally you'd have a great fortune. Yeah, you know, no. Let's, I'm, mm, I'm good. Very well, your just majesty, but you're no fun. Yeah, this is, this is the people's money. <laughs> I'm not gonna spell the people's mo spend the people's money on, like, a wager. Money. Come on now. <laughs> You return to the capital to await in news of the race. If we still win, my fellow counts, <laughs> we will laugh. Ending we season. Will in our yeah, castles. We will sit in our castles, we'll throw our heads back and laugh. <laughs> wow. I'm not counting on it. So, Ooh. you guys can use your personal wealth to do things. And, um, so... Use command funds, fun. X for the character code, and Y is the amount you're spending. So each of you can vote on the specific things, and that goes for like your specific region. So it won't affect the other regions, as far as I'm aware. Although uh, authority, I think, would like affect me. So. All right. Thank you for the follow, uh, Arik Aris. Thank you so much. We'll put a little bit of money in here. Yeah, and only two things will be built. Only the things that are spent most on. And thank you for the follow, David. No problem. Happy birthday. Thank you. <laughs> Actually, I'm going to put on some 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 warm socks because my feetsies are cold. You guys go go vote. Don't don't collude against me. Never. No, we wouldn't do that. So, North, we need the faith down quick. Martin of the North, I hear you too desire a lack of faith in the kingdom. Yes. Well, then we are united in this. Lovely. Then help by funding my observatory. <laughs> well, since my own efforts are lacking, I have no problem with that. And I'm back. I see. So you're lowering the decided on buildings. Mm-hmm. You're lowering fate, which I don't like, and you're raising authority, which is also not great for me in this case. Lovely. <laughs> How have you been enjoying the first real week of autumn, Luna? It's been so nice that it's no longer incredibly hot. I'm I'm very happy. Yes. Also, yes. it it is fake last season. We got like a like a speculas like baggy from like the local bakery, which had like different kinds of speculas, and I've I've been very much looking forward I, to it. <laughs> I hope you realize this is very Dutch. I know, but, I I know. Like I don't know it, and I dated a Dutch person for a year. Please explain. Okay, speculas is a type of um, a cookie, basically, a very specific flavor profile. <laughs> Okay. Uh, I, I, you really can't explain speculas other than it has a very specific taste because there's nothing quite like it, um, except paper note, which is also Dutch. So that that isn't going to help. <laughs> I, I don't. Oh boy. 
The Dutch thing <laughs> tastes like a Dutch thing. Yeah, it's like <laughs> we're using similar spices in our different types of Well, at least cookies. unlike the English, you guys actually use the spices that you went across the world for. Mm, yeah. Imagine building a world-spanning empire and not Wait, taking how do advantage you... of it. How do you spell that? Speculas. I'll type it in chat. S P E. Oh, I was not oh, expecting a C. We we have speculatius. Yeah. E. I mean, that makes sense. We are bordering. E. Oh, those look nice. Well, we're doing th two things that benefit us and undermine you. <laughs> what a twist! <laughs> and yes. I've been, good. been anticipating autumn all year and finally here. I can finally go outside without hating it as much. <laughs> there are two things I can't stand in this world. It's the intolerant and the Dutch. Damn. <laughs> what did we do except invent the stock market and there maybe... There are so many things that you guys did. <laughs> capitalism and <laughs> war crimes and... <laughs> hmm. You guys made it so that I have to make money. I mean, money existed before us. Yes, but you made it a necessity. <laughs> Small birthday gifts of the... Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. And I mean, no, we just invented the stock market. Okay, but I wish to transcend stock market and return to trade. Yeah, we are also about that. So I don't think you're going to win on that. I, wi I wish to collude against Luna. <laughs> Which IKEA plushie do you think she'll enjoy the most? Hey, wait a second. Don't threaten me with gifts. <laughs> oh, you bet I will! <laughs> At least we're not Britain. At least we're not Britain. At least we're not the English. <laughs> That's the entirety of Europe. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> <laughs> At least you're saying English. In the twisty passages of your castle, you can avoid your advisors, the nobles, even the spy master. There's one person you can't avoid. Your mother. Oh boy. Oh no, boy. Why haven't you found a spouse yet? It's been almost a year. <laughs> <laughs> but Ma, I don't want to get married. Nonsense. A queen can't rule alone. Don't worry. I'll take the liberty of finding eligible candidates. What is your preference? Men? Woman? Do you not mind? I want the pirate queen. <laughs> I mean, it's the women, then. Yeah, I guess it's the women, then. Just, just that one woman, actually. Yeah, one woman. <laughs> one very specific I'll woman. <laughs> I'll send out messengers to the most influential noble families in the kingdom. Let's see what they have to offer. My mom was British, I, Angie. I love how excited you make her. It, <laughs> it really it, sounds like it's... If, it's very fitting. I want to be a grandmother. Now! <laughs> Happy Why all day! You? Thank you, Sophia! Mom, I don't have a spouse! Why don't you have a spouse? <laughs> <laughs> Half English, that's fair. The One oh, Piece I'm isn't an option. I'm a kingdom right now. I don't have time to go dating. Why Pir don't you have Tinder yet? Pirate Queen, oh Pirate Queen. Where art thou, oh Pirate Queen? <laughs> <laughs> a delicious discovery. Am I discovering my Pirate Queen? Ooh, snack. Hey. <clears throat> Word from the boat race, your august majesty. Count Vizi has sent a letter by Seagull. How the flip did they manage to do that? Those... Seagulls are... <laughs> they are... Huh? Did you have mind control a seagull? Queen. There is no way you could make it... My queen. There's we no way you could... of many things. There's no way you could make the... those bastards listen to anything. <laughs> the race is disastrous, Lady Patrician. Lady Patrician Tentacle is ahead, but I hope to catch up soon. The bad news is that although we have brought lots of preserved cabbages with us, uh, weevils have got have got into the barrels. If we're not careful, I'll starve, and my sailors will be hungry too. <laughs> I should just bring um... their blood or something. <laughs> Yeah, the, uh, I'll starve, and I, I guess the older people in this boat might also go hungry. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, Australian bloke. I appreciate it. Well, VLC is partial to rats. Oh, yeah, you're right. 
You would be able to communicate with the <laughs> with the, with the sea rats. Hey, sea rat! <laughs> Fetch! Bring it to the fucking queen! She'll get you candy or something. I don't know the spiegel things. Ask for those. The like good news is that we have found this unfamiliar kelp that could be the answer to our prayers. But we don't know if it is poisonous. Hmm, delicious delicacy? Poisonous tea. I would usually test it on someone from my dungeons, but... He asks for guidance on whether to use the seaweed for food. What do you say, your serene highness? I'm not a biologist. What, why am I being asked this? Oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> Oh boy. Hmm. He should eat the seaweed. Leave it alone. Could be dangerous. From the speedy investigation by the university. Oh huh. my chat. Do you like to gamble? Gamba. Yeah, you guys are gonna gamble in Vizzy's life, huh? Depends if you enjoy it. Yeah, you know what? I'm I I Am I gonna get sick in game two? You might just die. Just oh, skipping the sickness, just straight up gone. But hey, you had that immortality on, serum, didn't you? <laughs> I'll I'll let fate decide. I'm not gonna. Listen, if it's if it's actually uh, actually super tasty, you'll be a made businessman. Yeah, the patrician <laughs> mindset. If this works, you'll can make money of it. <laughs> That's a lot of woods. There's, there's like two choices. Yes. Either you'll die or you'll discover a new food. Well, life is a game. <laughs> One that you might lose just about now. <laughs> if you die, you won't have to pay out the bet. I, I guess not. This is true. <laughs> and I will be back. Oh, oh. Soon you hear from Vizzy once more. How exquisite! The seed oh. seed tastes oddly like meat. And after we figured out how to cook it properly, the sailors love it. It's become quite the delicacy. Oh, well, congratulations! Yes, it even has that irony twang at times. <laughs> Why, I feel invigorated just writing about it. I've sent a shipment to the east so that the Count's can sell this new dish. Well, I guess the patricians oh, were right. It's like, hey, I can make money of this. <laughs> for once, so I thank the patricians. <clears throat> the competitors are equal in the race. Well, isn't that interesting? I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm so glad for my follow court member. Yes. Oh, my colleague. Sailing so... up and coming side by side with your <laughs> ship, just munching on seaweed. <laughs> Why, hello there! I took a gamble as you suggested, and it paid off. <laughs> Great, the vampires now can live on the sea. <laughs> with my experienced seafaring tips. <laughs> the Archbishop's request. can live on the sea. Oh. oh. Who's the bishop? Was I the bishop? Yeah, you were the bishop. Your majesty, I wish to speak with you about the situation in the north. Too long have the northerners been allowed to worship their heathen tree gods in the brazen defiance of the ninth gold. Allow me to send some of my best missionaries to the north. It's for the good of the realm. North, do not allow this. We need faith down. I can bring it to the council, or I could just ignore you guys and decide on my own. Um, you have my express permission. Let's hope this doesn't bring down its ability more. Oh, I'm gonna make it. Bring me it down. ascending a fucking wonderful to the north. I will make the beware. preparations right away. <laughs> the other regions the are less than thrilled that you did not consult the council about the archbishop's request, but it doesn't stop the mission from going ahead as planned. You know, you know what? No, I don't mind. You should make your own decisions. Oh, flip. My authority went up. That's not what I wanted. Yeah. I guess I. it didn't tell me that it would do you that. You should put your foot down and decide <laughs> for yourself. I fully agree with that. Dang it. 
Martin of the North, I write you this in fast pace to warn you that the Archbishop is on his way to you. Beware. Also, have some seaweed. (laughs) Also, have this enveloped seaweed. Trust me, it tastes much more like flesh. Don't worry, we'll chop them down when they get here. And just come in and Vampire Pirate somehow made it in the game. <laughs> Yo ho, the blood <laughs> runs cold. No one expects a Lunar Inquisition. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, Slay Queen. Uh, I, I shouldn't though, because then the Queen will get slain. Ah, dang it. The results are less than promising. After being run out of more than a dozen towns in the north, the missionaries head back to the capital with, the t- with their tails between their legs. Hey, at least it brought up the warning worked. their faith oh. slightly, but... Why mm. did it go up if we chased them away? It probably, probably would have gone up with like two or three. Yeah, today. probably would have gone... It went up only a little bit. Still, the Archbishop hopes that their preaching might have led the ground, laid the groundwork for future attempts. Nope. Well, how, end of how a season. How have bring faith? Uh, they have to do it in four years, and it currently it's below. They need to twelve or less. So, um, currently. How do we need oh, it? Oh wow! I think you need it like right now, Vizzy. Yeah, like how? Uh, f- yeah. Next season. Oh yeah, I still need. In the coast, noble patrician Willcraft sits on a pier, watching the sharks swim in lazy circles beneath their dangling feet. Uh oh. Oh dear. They just called it. Suddenly, the water begins to boil and froth. The sharks swim off in terror. A huge, shaggy figure rises from the sea. <coughs> Ooh! It's Hagrid! Look at that guy! I love oh god, I, I, I don't think I can go gravelly enough. Ma- Martin, Lord. can you? Martin? I will. <laughs> Hold on. I think of Hagrid's voice. I mean, he's he starts his sentence with ye, so like. <laughs> you wanted to meet me? Make it quick. A giant squid is fighting a sperm whale thirty meters from here, and don't I miss it? <laughs> you know what? Fair. You know what? Fair. I thought we might have common goal. The queen has been overstepping her bounds recently, hasn't she? I just made one little decision on my own. Hmm. <laughs> Queen's Navy did anchor the ship over my favorite reef last month. Bloody annoying. Alright, I'll help you. But you better get rid of the bees first. What did the bees do? Just say... Just say bees. Aye. I'm just playing these simple insects. But in Apiary, the world of dreams and magic, they're powerful and intelligent. Call themselves the dreams of be- being. I did not expect the bees to be powerful dream beings. Oh, you'd be surprised. Oh, yeah, what yeah, yeah. Are they, they do that, yeah. <laughs> oh, I guess this is common knowledge. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know this. Then again, I don't read. Why do you think your eyes are crusty in the morning? It's it's the honey. <laughs> oh, damn. No, no, no. It's pollen. <laughs> My allergies. <laughs> That's why you have bloodshot eyes, too. <laughs> Moonfire, no. Bad Mordred. But hi, welcome Mordred. in. Mordred, put X Mark join. Join us. And hello, Toby. Thank you. Thank you so much for coming in. Join oh, yeah. the chefs. <laughs> Bees Martin. do like their queens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that does actually track. Martin? Yes. Uh... They have an innate fondness for royalty, and sometimes protect monarchs for magical inf- interference. But they won't harm non-magical folks beyond the occasional sting, so you can deal with them. For the next stage, lower- there's for the next stage of their scheme, the patricians must lower all regions combined farming to 14 or less in four seasons. Okay. <laughs> you guys are killing the bees! Not the bees! Kill the bees! Kill the bees. <laughs> As a former beekeeper, what the fuck? <laughs> it's okay. We can we can also just we can just kill the flowers and the trees, and then the bees will just follow. Yeah. Hmm. That is not better. 
It's okay, we can replace them with artificial flowers. So, I think you guys can pay a little more. <laughs> Fuck the bees. <laughs> well, they're the least defiant. So, you know, they can... Um... <laughs> Hmm. Am I worried about you guys' defiance? Are you? A little. I think defiance we'll keep it at no worry. It tries. Oh, in that case. <laughs> oh, we stand ready to serve. Do not worry. Alicia. I hope you'll remember this favor. Make a noise. Oh! Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> <laughs> I will raise your taxes. We are raising the defiance to increase the odds that your latest invention may come in handy. Merry spawn point, Miss Luna. I wishing you a happy evicted from the body day. Sending much love, s'mores, and an appropriate amount of moon fire. Wait, no, please see setting. We we have small fire. Small fire for s'mores works just fine. Oh, noble overboard. Oh, I I, th I think the race isn't going so good. I swear, if the count threw a fucking banana peel on my ship. <laughs> Why would I ever do something like that? Darling. You're... Go, Skyrats, go! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking drop bombing banana. <laughs> yeah. You know the standard vampire theme of like bats or crows around them? My ship is just surrounded by seagulls. <laughs> <clears throat> Your esteemed highness. We've had messages from Lady Patricia Tancadle. I was indulging in some crap. <laughs> you were drunk driving. <laughs> I was. <laughs> I was. One second. <laughs> so. I was indulging in some grog with the crew one evening, and inadvertently fell into the water. Obviously I survived, thanks to a group of passing finfolk who dragged me from danger, as they do usually. But they won't return me to my boat without payment. Damn, being held hostage by the mermen. <laughs> Greedy fucking merfolk. <laughs> You're a patrician, you want to talk. <laughs> How dare they claim payment for such a simple, nice thing? <laughs> How dare they want to be repaid for their services? See, this is why we stay away from the ocean. Oh, God. <laughs> Go, I just might realign with the Norch, you're making me look back. Oh, no. David says, can I choose to get bit by the toad lean on the vampire? I don't know, I think he's on a seaweed diet right now. Of course you'll pay the ransom, your esteemed highness, won't you? Didn't you have, like, a sponsorship? Yeah, yeah you that went into the boat. You sponsor them. <laughs> like, that, that was to make the, you know, the whole figurette, you remember? Like, the crown, yeah? Hey, Alicia, remember, <laughs> A will lower the chance of a, re of a revolution. Yeah. Um... I don't want to go broke, so then again... Your defiance is getting... Yeah. I'm not sure how high it can, how high it can go. I'm just gonna say let's not, you, you, you guys decide on... I gotta go, my partner's having another meltdown episode, or uh, if I come up... For dialogue, go ham with the voice or whoever. All right, good luck. Take care. Playing a Digimon game. Would you like to name my Saber Draymond? It's like a black, freaky, phoenix, phoenix, phoenix dingo. Gonna be a ninja burp. 
Oh, ninja. I, I would love to be the ninja burp. May, may I be the ninja burp? I need to stack my favors here, my darling. Okay, I guess we are... We don't have a very strong military, but I guess we're gonna attempt that anyway. Let, let's just go war with the fish people whilst we're doing a race on their waters. I'm sure that won't go wrong at all. <laughs> oh, apparently it is fine. I told you, it, it won't go wrong at all. Fine. Yeah, it would have been easier to just pay the ransom, but I guess we can start trouble with the merfolk. It's, it's okay. Once the finfolk have surrendered, they reluctantly advise Lady Patricia's tank cattle on her upcoming route and how to avoid treacherous reefs. Lady Patrician tank cattle is in the lead, pushing ahead as the race nears its end. Laden with valuable pearls and corals looted from the finfolk dam, <laughs> the troops return yeah. triumphantly from the coast. You guys, you really just got like health for oh, ransom right. and then made money of it. Why do I imagine, like, over the ladder, it's like these big, beefy <laughs> merfolk people? When you get there, it's just a couple of murlocs from World of Warcraft. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh no, I'm gonna have to choose a spouse. Expect me next year to show up here with, like, covered in pearls <laughs> and shells and coral. Yes. <laughs> I have found three potential matches for you. One eligible young woman from each of the kingdom's three regions. Choose wisely. You'll be securing a powerful alliance. Uh, what if I don't want to marry any of them? Um, excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> I want my pirate queen. <laughs> That's a decision that can't wait until after you've been seen them, isn't it? Uh, that can wait until after you've seen them. Just, just, just... Your mother leads you to the Great Hall, where she arranged three portraits on easels. For now, each is covered by a cloth. Wait, I don't even get to meet them? No, no. There's no time for sentiment. You just need to make... You just need a match that befits your station and suits your political needs. Damn, no love allowed. And love nonsense. Imagine if I'm one of the potential <laughs> partners. I and... see. <laughs> she whisks away the cloth from the first portrait. This is Hilda, firstborn daughter of the Northern Censura clan. Apparently, the other Northerners have nicknamed her Windspeaker. Can't imagine why. Hmm. Even among the Northerners, she's made something of a name for herself as a fearsome warrior. Had a bit of controversy a while back when her clan hall burned down. She was to blame somehow. Ah, an arsonist, I see. I suppose I see the appeal. This is Lorelei, the eldest daughter of the Eastern Mordred Starfallen dynasty. I met her at a party once, but all she did was squeak out a hello and run off. Seemed nice enough. Oh, relatable. <laughs> That's really cute. A very pious young lady. She's obsessed with her family's legacy. No oh, that might actually be... Also... No wonder she wants to be a crown wearer. Dang it, we're dropping frames according to OBS. Why today of all day is the interwebs being mean? Ah, an arsonist. I see the feel. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> You're starting to sound very uh, scandy, not gonna lie. And finally, from the coast, we have Camilla, the wealthy heiress to Lord Patrician David Mills estate. She's got a reputation for honesty and fair mindedness. That's her along the coast. Damn. Just casually insulting the patrician. This is right. <laughs> they beat up a bunch of fish people and took their stuff. <laughs> That's my girl. <laughs> fish people held me captive, okay? We had to just get away from that. <clears throat> Her interests are typical for the coast. Money, 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 and making more of it. But to her credit, she gives a lot of it to charity. I mean, I do also like money. I I will disapprove of the fact that you got ABBA stuck in my head now. 
<laughs> funny, funny, funny. <laughs> Must be funny. <laughs> what do you think? Of course, by picking a candidate, you'll anger the other regions, but you'll gain a lifelong alliance. Great. Uh, I made my decision. Well, which of them do you wish to marry? I... Oh, I can refuse to marry any of them. Yeah, <laughs> can oh you just go for your... No for your do I get a chance for a pirate queen if I do this? I mean, Maybe, there should we be, don't right? know. I guess I'm not marrying any of y'all, guys. <laughs> Screw you! It's, it's, pirate it's queen, here I you, come. It's luck-based if you get the pirate queen event, right? Yeah. Well, I, I only got it once. I the scale for you. <laughs> what do you mean by that? We have our ways. <laughs> you say that you? very often. Are you gonna mind I control a pirate queen? <laughs> I often succeed. In my defense, it often works when I use my ways. <laughs> With me here, you'll become pirate. <laughs> That's quite the Torian Tarian move. <laughs> marry my cousin. Happy birthday, Mina. Thank you. I'm gonna refuse to marry any of them. Even Although, daughter? Yeah, see, the only person that I think would be most interesting is the person that's very highly religious, because I do need to increase the fate. But I want to have a chance to the pirate queen, and I think that might get higher if I don't marry any. <laughs> Dang. Without a marriage, you're alone. No alliance and no support, not to mention an insult to the most powerful there families in the kingdom. What possible reason could you have for choosing not to marry? Oh, dang, it all lowers my stability. <clears throat> I want to live a life of chastity in honor of the ninth god. Oh, I can bring my fate oh, up. I, I can see not that. You, you're saying that, and then the pirate ring comes along and you go... <laughs> <laughs> like, need, you know? I need to go to the ocean. I feel like a bit thirsty. <laughs> uh, dang it. They all lower my stability, which is not what I want. Hmm. Yes, but lower your stability. Pirate queen. Well. I guess we'll go for you then. Or you. Hmm. Uh, the, the arsonist? Don't yeah. Over the fire. <laughs> You're gonna just ignore your pirate queen. Imagine she shows up. I think I'm gonna go east because Funny. east is like the, the fate one and I need that. Excellent. I'll make the arrangements. I think you just married Mordred's daughter. I... I think it was David. <laughs> Wait, what? No, I thought for the... It, it might have been. Like, there's a lot of nobles, okay? <laughs> Bad news, your highness. A meddling wizard has set up shop in Cosfan. What? I believe it's Pestia, the Lady of Pestilence. Oh, goodness, oh. more wizards. Oh, different wizards. Okay, good, good, good. All right. Wizards have managed to tame creation itself. They wield untold power and are... Uh, Naturally distrusted by the church. Even the High Inquisitor wouldn't dare to move against him openly. You know, I would also settle for a wizard girlfriend. You know, I have dated a wizard once. <laughs> that was long ago. <laughs> Pestler has influence over plagues, diseases, insects, and other horrid things like that. Wait, insects. Like yeah, bees. <laughs> <laughs> the, the land wizard and the sea f wizard go toe to toe. <laughs> She's put out a call for new apprentices, which is a rare event. It's a once in a lifetime opportunity for many. Hey, hey, can I learn magic? <laughs> <laughs> Droves of unwashed, glory seeking common folk from all over the north are lining up for their chance. I'm with you them. You really should have passed on getting a, getting a wife. I, I don't know if I could have wife this one. Not just peasants. I trans... <laughs> Wait, hold on. Trans rights. What voice? What voice do you want? What kind of voice do you want? Where's trans rights? 
Or was Translate the person who left? I know someone left. Uh, no. As f that was Protogen. Oh, whoops. I ah, I clicked in back into the game and it... Ah, no. Undo. Doesn't let me. Wait. Oh, uh, ah, shit. I was gonna... Hold on, I got away. I got a guy. I got... I was about to say I got a gay, but no, that's <laughs> not right. I mean, um. <laughs> I'm pretty sure there is enough gays here, so... <laughs> Okay, I got it. I figured out a way. I figured out a way. Okay. Do, do you read busy? You can you can gay. Um I <laughs> I can certainly put it down. Um okay, we'll have to go with that voice just You can gay though. I should go gay? Okay, we'll go really gay here. <laughs> Not just peasants. I, trans rights, have also decided to apply. The competition will be fierce, but those peasants are no match for the most powerful noble of this court has ever seen. You... You... <laughs> you can't put your clothes on if it wasn't for your servant's help. Damn! At least I get touched more than you do. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> can't let this go ahead. To have a potential wizard on the council would rep present a clear and dangerous conflict to interests. How? <laughs> Wizards an only answer to themselves. The power's unmatched. Such the entire kingdoms can he stand up against them. So how do I get wizard powers? <laughs> Even an apprentice on the council would be disastrous. Cunt trans rights could use magic to interfere with the votes. Or you, for that matter. Uh, I guess that wouldn't be good. Wizards, yes. Wizard Council. I'll heal the wizard. No! <laughs> God bless you, your majesty. Even though I'm no faithful. <laughs> <laughs> but hey, your God bless no. you. Yeah, exactly. Gods, not God. <laughs> um... Yeah, that's all fine by me. Hmm... I think they should forfeit their noble title. Take their money. You guys want to take their money? I feel like we need an apprentice of this thing. Chat, do I we... Feel... Go on. We you know will what? put a wizard on the council. I personally feel like, as the Scottish folk, we should not let them anywhere near it. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna be honest here. It is not the smartest choice, but letting them be. <laughs> yes. Well, that's fair. We need oh, yeah. to see where this plotline goes. Agent. Hey, Fuck, <laughs> <laughs> I've just got no room. <laughs> Vote A, I'm folks. Vote for C. Fuck off, Scotch. Y'all ruined Scotland. <laughs> Excuse me. We made Scotland brilliant. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> well, I tried. My nana married a Scot. I and you call her nana because it's Scottish. I know what the Scots do. <laughs> that sounds <laughs> ominous. So do we. We bond in churches. You'll uh, have to teach me your ways. I do need to lower faith in my region. Quite easy. Get a bottle of booze, put a rag in it, fire, throw. <laughs> oh, it's that simple. Sounds like an awful waste of wine. <laughs> Doesn't need to be wine, it could be any cheap rubbish. <laughs> oh, that's great. Tentacle! What? <laughs> hey, Martin, can you read? <laughs> Sorry, yes. I was busy counting pearls. <laughs> Oh, he was talking about that I needed alcohol of a cheaper variety. I feel like you peddled that. Um, wow! Wow! <laughs> wow! <laughs> friendly fire! Friendly fire! We has the best grass. Oh, yes, I know that it's quite potent. I saw your little tumble. <laughs> Yeah, I tumbled, I tumbled, I fell right into this treasure of pearls. Martin? And the yep. army had to get you. <laughs> By the old gods, how will they keep up with their noble duties if they're spending all the time in the north with the wizards? 
And what if gods be good? They actually passed their apprenticeship. There's never been a wizard in the council before. You never know, it might liven things up around here. You have nothing to fear from me, your highness. I'll always have the kingdom's interest as hard, even as a wizard. Mm. I need a new robe! Wonderful! I shall have a longer robe and a hood. There must be a hood, yes. And it must be pointy. <laughs> Cons trans rides sense of uh, sets off immediately on their journey to the north. Bestia's presence in Kolsham attracts all sorts of visitors, though the power of her latent magic starts to wield crops for miles around. Oh, great. Oh, oh that's not good. They lowered their farming enough. We need, we need to raise the farming. Raise the farming. I've seen that happening. I sure didn't. I saw it coming, but having a wizard on the council was too fun to pass that up. <laughs> to be fair, I too like a wizard on the council, even though it's not good for me. Before wait, we continue, why did our defiance? No, wait, we wanted to tie for Alicia's sake. Yeah, see, you're kind of mad because I didn't marry your person. Uh... Oh, it's the North that I'm seeing. That's oh yeah, the, the 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 North is mad that I didn't. Ma marry your person you guys are fine because i and like i both married your person and i allowed you to be a wizard noble so like it's like oh hey that's kind of cool of you texas <laughs> um nobody will rise up before we continue i need a water break so i'm gonna fill my water and we're gonna have like an ad I, break of three minutes i will fill my glass as well yeah so we'll be right back you guys will still be heard but uh yeah one moment. Also, hello, Rainyard. We're we're just we're just gonna be gone for three minutes because I really need some water. <laughs> We've been talking a lot. I suggest you guys get some water too. Uh, one moment. Hey, hey, hey. Be right back. Also, if anyone has not done so, if you oh. put exclamation mark join, you can join the game and vote for what happens. You know what have been funny though? Yeah. Pestula takes control. And suddenly there's more bees. Specifically more bees. Oh, that would be funny. And the entire goal is like, the guy shows up as like, yeah, you tried to do it. It didn't work. There's more bees. All this. Mm. Hello. I mean, you probably need to just Hello. eat more stable stuff, like more yeah. fibers and shit. Hi. Yeah, especially more fibers. Like, oh God. Talking about food food issues. Yeah, yeah, my god. Yeah. I need to just become a vampire and like I can transcend the need for it. Just don't trust your gut feelings. <laughs> <laughs> but my gut feelings are giving such fun ideas. I've had a nickel for every time someone named Luna got thrown into the river of <laughs> uh getting on the castle on her birthday. <laughs> Luna has a vault to Yatsa Garum. I am a ninja burb, yes. <laughs> Would lecture you for not having breakfast, but laying here intending to skip it and straight to brunch. Well, the thing is that for some people, fasting in the morning just works better. Like, breakfast is important, but also moments of fast, like, don't have to be bad for you. It just kind of depends on the person and it kind of depends on the reasons why you're doing it. If it's like, for a healthy reason of, I don't know, this just works better for my body. I just don't have an appetite in the morning. I feel better if I wait and then just eat a hearty lunch. Then, like, go for it. Because eating, like, against your will also isn't good. But if it's more like, I don't feel like I should eat or deserve to eat, or if you're denying yourself yeah. food, then that is not a healthy reason. And you shouldn't Aww. you shouldn't go with that. It, it just really I depends. I usually don't get, like, seriously hungry until, like, I don't know, 12 or 1. If your brain ever tells you, I don't deserve this, don't listen to it. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I'm struggling with that right now. Allow but the I'm, soft I'm animal soft. that is your body to enjoy things. Ooh. 
In a tiny village far to the east, two counts meet in a derelict tavern. No one dares even glance in their direction. Oh, it's Progen. Uh, uh, they wanted uh, either me or Martin yeah, to voice them. you or Martin, so I think Martin there. I can do it, yeah. The church still has the east thoroughly in its grasp. Yes, but by the blood of the deed, dead. it's not over yet. <laughs> oh, by the blood of the dead. I mean, it doesn't make much yes, sense. Son. Maybe the yeah. dead are his deed. <laughs> <laughs> well, I do not murder and sell. Yes, but by the blood of the dead, it's not over yet. I have stomach issues, but I keep forgetting to seek medical help for... It keeps me perpetually feeling not hungry, so I kind of have to force myself. Yeah, I, I have the same. Um, the medicine I take for my ADHD makes it so I just don't have an appetite, especially not in the morning. So even though I don't feel hungry, I can feel that my stomach is empty and I do know that I have to eat. So it's not that I'm like forcing myself, like I'm not like sitting here like, oh, I don't want to put anything in my mouth. But I, I am like, yeah, I'm not actually hungry, hungry, but I am eating because I know my body needs nutrients and I will feel bad if I don't. It's just that I don't feel the hunger sensation. It's a gamon's next evolution with ninja burp. Heck yeah, ninja burp. The count's aim is to lower their fate to four or less. Ah, unfortunately, you you're very faithful right now. Okay. Oh, I read that as call for vanity, and I got excited <laughs> for a moment. You already have the maximum. Please choose one of the current laws below to replace. I don't think I need extra authority right now. Defiance is too high and one or more regions is considering rebellion. Rebelling will stop the region from advancing their scheme and they can't be taxed or take part in normal votes. Oh dear, the northerners are on the verge of rebellion. Oh, oh goodness, the region with Alyssa in it is on the verge of rebellion? <laughs> Who would have expected? <laughs> how, how ever did that happen? I wonder. Yeah, because I was going to say, it's not a thing that if Defiance got too high, we could just turn around and kill you. Um, yeah, you guys, you can start a rebelling. So, the Chiefs may vote to rebel by typing exclamation mark rebel. Remember, if you do that, you are your one way and all the other people will start working against you because if people rebel, then the other people lose. So, yeah, yeah, you I know, want to see you what happens really, rebel. You Chief should really bolt rebel. Uh, rebel. Bolt our military if you get the chance, like the patricians would never betray you. Yeah, let's go to my wedding. <laughs> <laughs> Your wedding to Lorelei is naturally the talk of the kingdom. Nobles and peasants alike travel from across the realms at tents. For a week and a day, the capital is one giant party. It feels like you're the only one not taking part. Instead, you're getting ready for the ceremony. Soon enough, you're standing at St. Bernard's Cathedral with Lorelei at your side. Do you take this woman as your lawfully wedded wife? <laughs> I've changed my mind, I can't do this! I, I, I do. <coughs> then I pronounce you queen and wife. After the wedding, of course, there's a feast. And after the feast, a dance. Your new wife, Lorelai, turns bright red every time a toast is called in her honor. Aww. 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 Hey, the defiance ben went down. No. <laughs> no, she is one of the ones who has blood running through her veins for now. <laughs> oh, no. By the time you find yourself alone with Lorelai, it's past midnight and you've never felt more tired. Um, hello? Do I just point out that this is awkward? I mean, that, that's a good icebreaker, I guess. Yeah, she's shy like me. Like, this is, this is awkward. We can just acknowledge it. 
Um, I'm sorry. Oh no! Oh. I can tell you need some space right now. I think she might need some space. Yes, yes, I I think that would be good. Thank you. S sorry. Oh. <laughs> it's been a big day. Many people. Yeah. yeah. Farewell, Very Pirate strange. Queen. Pirate Queen will be another time. Oh. You had to uh, spare Bat Chamber, leaving Lorelai alone. She will open up to you eventually, right? I hope so. Let's not rush things. We have like an entire life still. The end is yeah, near. Oh wait. boy. Oh. I want to see I mean, in the north star. We will go coastal check in the north races. in a moment. <laughs> the coastal, the coastal boat race is nearly uh, close. I am pleased to announce that Lady Patrician Tenkettle is all set to win. Oh. Oh, hey, Martin! <laughs> How exciting. <laughs> Truly, this race is utmost importance. On a completely unrelated note, I have a shipment of lumber that's due to intercept the race on any day now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> It'd be a shame if that boat went on fire and going towards them. <laughs> <laughs> if my ship got in the way, who knows what might happen? I dare say the race's outcome could be altered. Are you? Don't you dare. <laughs> we are rebellious after all. <laughs> of course, I could be convinced to alter the shipment's route instead. Your Serene Highness, we must put a stop to this shameless attempt to sabotage the race. This is a honest race. An honest race. Without any inter <laughs> interferences or meddling. <laughs> well, <laughs> They did get advice from the fish people. <laughs> yeah, th that was totally given, not under duress at all. <laughs> this is basically what I imagine Luna's wedding night to be like. Part, part of the of the sea, they they belong in that race. That's fine. <laughs> <laughs> Long stressful day, social battery drained. We sleep now in separate bedrooms. <laughs> that that would be yeah. I don't sleep well with other people nearby. I need my own room. <laughs> also, by the way, what do you guys think of the background? I made it myself. Especially for this day. I made it, like, so we would have more space for the it people. It's really well. Wow. Thank you. Very nice. I, I made, like, the game window smaller than I usually have it. So we there's, actually have more space for you guys. A shame. One. It's that soon red flames will lick up those windows <laughs> and stain them black. Hey, no fire to my, my pretty area. Well, I will not set fire to anything. Looks I... over to Martin. <laughs> Is Margaret, that... Oh. My <laughs> Wait a second. Can you can you check real quick who who is in which team? Um, yeah, I was going to ask that because I want to know how many of the north. Because okay, I... There are many in the north. You okay, seem to all be evenly north. dispersed. We're actually even now. The North, anyone who's in here, remember, exclamation mark rebel, and we can start fighting. Um, have the counts pay for the ship to obstruct Lady Patrician's, uh, Patrician Tenkaddle's spots? To obstruct the Count's Vizzy spots? Refuse the shameless bribe. Okay, Ye wait, I'm gonna, real quick, uh, Patrician's, because just my, um, extension, but out a little bit uh, mm -hmm. because I had to refresh the site, but oh, it's, it's being weird. Whatever. <laughs> I don't care how small the room is. I cast blast spread. Okay. Um, I would refuse the shameless bribe. We can't buy vote yet, chat. Yeah. Yes, we press start the vote. I haven't pressed start the vote yet. I'm trying to think of uh what to do. Once you see the three of us start voting, then you know that it's live. And yeah. there we go. You know, the North getting a bribe would be pretty good. Go ahead. No, don't, don't, oh, don't waste any money on it. No way. Yeah, but Kingdom's treasury ah. be touched for this meddling. It's Someone vote B. Really wouldn't be vote a good B. look, right? We need two votes on B. It's reverse voting time. How organized yeah, are you guys? Good. 
I caught that. I Whoa, caught that, and I was like, wait shit. a minute. <laughs> <laughs> you're, you're gonna brave us one way or another. Uh, I I really I, thought that I you guys would vote for A or B. I would have otherwise would have done something else. I should really start reading. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I what won't, but I should. Before, I was now, well, I kind of wanted the opposite of this, but. <laughs> <laughs> now you have to choose. Who yeah. Hmm. I mean, on, we can farm the, the back. You can just you can just let it. Like, let him be more in the back, it's fine. No, no, we'll no, you cow. don't need to. No! <laughs> <laughs> That's just an outrage. Yeah, I'm sorry. I didn't really want to. I, I didn't expect them to vote for nothing. It, like... You know, it's fine. It's fine. At least I still have my corals. Chief uh, Solrock Martin's lumbering ship makes its slow way in front of Ten Cattle's boat, blocking the way to the finish line. The lumber makes its way to Tavalin ahead of schedule. Soon, nobles and peasants alike gather at the finish line, watching breathlessly as the winner arrives. And it's both Lady Patricia and Ten Cattle and Count Vizzy crossing the lines to him simultaneously. Clearly, I won. My oars crossed the line before yours. My seagulls were ahead. Your sea the seagulls are <laughs> different. <laughs> but oars aren't part of the boat. My prowl was over the line first. Just because you're using a big heavy ship doesn't mean that you're... <laughs> Your esteemed highness, these nob nobles have bet their life saving on the race. Both have legitimate claim. What should we do? Play stupid game, win stupid prizes. That's what I say. <laughs> Technically, they both lost! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I mean... That is funny, though. That is very funny. But I think I would um, incite uh, rebellion in the patricians if I did that. Um, I mean, your authority would go up, though. Yeah, but I don't need my authority up. <laughs> I... I'm inclined to say the answer is simple. It was a draw. Then again, I guess I do want their defiance to go down. So I'm going to declare the patricians the winner. Wow. Oh, biased. <laughs> yeah, very biased. Hey, you were the one that wanted to, like, got bribes to stop the, to interfere with the race. So. Hey, I'm a businessman. Don't blame me. <laughs> Marvelous. Of course the patricians would win such a mighty sea battle, uh, race. And I couldn't have done it without the generous sponsorship of Queen Luna. Yay! This is an outrage! An unjust scandal! It's time to pay up. Damn it. I can't even s And I don't know what happened to my sea likes. I'm playing politics here, we can afford expensive races, but not honesty. <laughs> Who am I vibing with today? Uh, it seems that you're on Vizzy's team. Thank you, thank you very much. Perhaps you'd like a rematch in a year's time. Damn. <laughs> no, I'm never setting foot on a boat again. You salty sea urchin. <laughs> Didn't we actually have a race last year? Yeah, you you did have a race last year too. <laughs> Back on the coast, merchants flock to investigate Tank Cattle's boat and use her sailing techniques to improve their own craft. Oh, I sure hope you guys never need trade because damn. Though the race is over, it's gripped the kingdom. Similar bets take place as far afield as Sal and Kurt, some successful and others ending in watery deaths. And let's go... Oh, Plague of Rats! This is not fitting. Oops. Count Late Lee strides into the council... Hey, Lee, it's you! Strides into the council chambers, distraught, waving a dead rat back to... Oh, for Dredo! What kind of voice do you want? Also, while Late Lee says that, I'll just give Luna a treat of... I got caught! <laughs> I have to make a noise. 
<laughs> I don't. I still don't Bobby know what accent. it. Hold up, hold up. Let me. I need to find a video of like that one guy from Australia. What's his fucking name? Steve. Something. Steve the Irwin. Guy? Yeah. Steve Irwin. That's the guy. Missed. Ah. Give me a couple seconds. We don't like to call it plague of rats in these parts. We call it a party of rats. Yes, yes, yes. Did you know the little a party group people? Of rats? Did you know a group of rats is called a mischief? I did not. Yes. That is so cute. Did you know a group of no, owls is called a are. parliament? Although I would say call the council instead. I kind of like council vowels better. Oh, there's also like swarm and pack. All right, I think I found it. I'm not the best with this accent. I don't train it much, but the bees and barns of the east are overrun by vermin, and we no more poison for these horrible things. We can't cope anymore. I think that's actually quite poison good. Rats? Come on now, they're cute little buggers. Can the council help resolve the eastern rat plague? <laughs> Send them a shipment of cats. <laughs> um. Mind you, you want your farming up. I do, but this is like a farm test, not a farm up. Yeah. Uh. Hey, I mean, maybe it will turn out that the rats are super duper edible and it rates us their farm. Yeah. I mean, we could, we could send them cats. Come on, let's send them some cats. I'm quite alright getting cats. <laughs> or uh, supply of rat poison, that also sounds good. I mean, the cats are super... Yeah, or we could just have them handle it alone. You know, no, 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 I'm gonna say just, just cats, I just, you know. Don't forget to vote, See guys. Hey, votes. No, not the cat. Oh. Both, both, both are super See. cute. Well, I hope that you guys would like all vote for one thing, but alas, I am less good at predicting you guys than I thought. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna send them a shipment of cats. Really? Yeah. Come on now. Where's your sense of adventure? Gone with the adventurers that we didn't hire. <laughs> Messi, you did me proud. You did it so like a Nazi, but you tried the best. Hey, it was a distinguished accent. I think it was I, good. I feel like it probably lead too much towards like British. It's funny if we type because then you rile up half of chat. <laughs> Count late Lee bows to you deeply. I can't thank you enough, Your Highness. You send a caravan of cats over to the east. By the time they reach the destination, they're both hungry and very angry. The perfect rat catching mindset. <laughs> okay, come on, cats. Don't oh, fuck! Oh no! You had an E percent chance and it failed. Damn. Bad luck. But despite the promising start, the cats prefer lazing around in the sun to actually catching vermin. The cats oh, lament the God. foolishness of the council. Oh so no! Valid. Crikey. Uh, we I should have expected. Favor of the cats cats never do what you want them to do. <laughs> Aww. Can I see who is in my clan, please? I, we need one more vote for a bet. Yeah, I'm gonna end the season before you get to do that. <laughs> but now you get to see. <laughs> An ancient legend is resurfacing in the Norge, yet the chiefs can't agree on where. I'm telling you, my aunt's second cousin dug up a horn not long ago that looks just like the carvings. You aren't always digging things up. I haven't get authority of the horn is somewhere on my lines. The sagas confirm it. I've told you a thousand times, Solrock Martin. It doesn't mean hornblower in the old tongue. It means blower of... <laughs> oh, hey, hey, yo, hold up. Hold the fuck. Enough. If we recover the horn, we must earn the gods' favor. While well, you two bicker our enemies and the name church grow stronger. Yay, church! I'll burn it. I'll set it on fire. <laughs> Simple. He is Scottish. 
Why is Martin the best voice for the North? Because he's Scottish. This is my actual accent when I speak normally, but I suppress my accent quite a bit so folks can understand me. Like, this is a suppressed accent, essentially. Like, yeah, I'm impressed with how was... well you're able to suppress your accent. I can't control my accent, like, at all. It it just fluctuates. If I, I spend enough... Away, mine. Yeah, if I spend enough time with a certain, like, someone with a strong accent, my accent will just fluctuate to sound like that. That That is... <laughs> that's the only change I can make, and it's not a conscious one. It's funny, I can actually do a little bit of Irish for that same reason, because my grandfather was full-blooded yeah. Irish. <laughs> I yeah. love the fact that I told you one time that, hey, Irish and Scottish are similar, just higher your pitch. <laughs> And you did it, and you're like, oh my god, you're right! And I'm like, yes! I've told you! People will have my head on a pike, but then they try it, and it's like, oh dear god. Mine disappeared after a few years of watching native English speakers. Yeah, I have been watching, like, native English speakers from when I was very young, and... Did, yeah. Like, okay, it didn't work for me. You'll hear, you'll hear mine on my J's. That's the one that I'll occasionally fuck up. But if I were to like lean into a Swedish accent, it would probably be something like this, where even if I'm yoking, you can't really tell. Or no, if I say something like yoking or yolk of an egg, you'll be able to tell. Oh that. yeah, the the Swedish J. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. I I do not know that from some of the other people. Because there's no D's in the J in Swedish. Yep. <laughs> oh, and Luna. Oh, 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 oh. Speaking in a funny way. Okay. See, I, I actually tried one time to like just um, exaggerate, exaggerate my uh, German accent, and I have trouble speaking more stereotypically than I already do. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, Chromac. I used to be able to exaggerate my Dutch accent, but I can't do it anymore. Like, I used to be at least... Oh, there's cats making sounds outside. Oh no, the, the cats, they are fighting. Um... Probably, <laughs> if I lean too much into my Swedish accent, I'll just start speaking Swedish. <laughs> like... Okay, maybe, maybe if I... If I okay. <clears throat> the, the chief's aim is to lower... <laughs> go on, you know? go on. Oh, it, it takes all my concentration. <laughs> yeah, Alicia exaggerating her French is so good. A late night visit. Ooh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, I, I used to be able to exaggerate my Dutch accent, but I can't do it anymore. It's like, because we have a name for it when you like speak English real bad, or like if you speak English basically by speaking Dutch, but like, <laughs> giving it an accent. Oh no! D Silver, you'll have to show me what an exaggerated Egyptian accent sounds like sometime. Also, I fucking love the combo. Swede, love ya. Want to fight ya. <laughs> Fun fact, in wartime, Swedes would check if someone was Russian, a uh, Russian spy by making them say Cannibula. Cinnamon bun. Russians just couldn't do it. They'd say, "Can can ya can ya bola?" Can ya bola? Huh? Huh? I mean, as a Dutch, you can check if someone is not a Dutch or not by making them say "schoolfotograaf." Or bless you, Schravenhagen. <laughs> or okay. The thing is, I can't roll the R. Yeah, I just can't. Like it's it's part of the German language, but. No. <laughs> Happy birthday, thank you! And thank you for stopping by! What's the best voice and why is it Tali from Mass Effect? I don't... <gasps> Hi, friend! Oh, no. oh, they started the choo-choo! <laughs> choo-choo! Scheveningen. I have three yeah, yeah, bits German. left, but you know what? Here. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> choo -choo. And I have to make a noise. Also... <laughs> Chat I'm so jealous. Reminder. I just. Yeah, people. People are kind of like flickering the tip of their tongue on their mouth roof, and I yeah. can't. 
Basically, you put your tongue on the roof of your mouth and you relax it a little and then you blow air through it. I will say it's a similar thing to being able to do this. <laughs> you see, oh, I, I have to actually goggle my R's. I have to do. Yeah. You want to do it more forward because gargling isn't very reliable. Although I, I still want to learn how you growl like that. I should be able to do it because I can say the just fine. And like, I'm sure it's like a similar thing, but... Like, it's... So I'm... Okay, hold on. Let me try and feel it out. So I put... My tongue is pressed against my lower teeth. Lower and teeth. And then I run... I run the air across the roof of my mouth. Oh! Huh. So I think it's the fact that there's, like, a little bit of, um lines up at the top of your mouth you know uh-huh i think the, the ridges that's what, yeah i think it's the ridges that it rolls across i think that's what it is i don't know for sure my mouth roof is super smooth oh uh, what the fuck wait how is your skill issue like <laughs> behind your upper teeth there's like ridges there yeah a little bit but there's just the ones I think... behind I think it's teeth, yeah. Like I, just, just that one set. And just, where just I feel it is like mildly. you know where your nose connects in. I think it's there. Wait, your nose connects yeah, in? Yeah. Oh yeah, your nose connects to your mouth, right? I, I mean, yeah, but that's like at the back. That's where the sound is coming. Um. Yeah, yeah, it's just, it's that place. It's like if you breathe in heavily through your nose, you should be able to feel the spe the place. Like, <sighs> Wait, that's just how I do ours. <laughs> <laughs> Here we are just all making growling noise. <laughs> Let's go to the like, late night visit. Like I had several people get really scaroused by my growling and werewolf voice, <laughs> and I practiced it a lot. That's, that's why. I mean, to be fair, I also want to learn the art of growling on command because I just think it sounds cool. We will practice it when I'm over. Interrupting the game for an extensive improved pronunciation course <laughs> is what I'm sure <laughs> One evening, you're sorting through paperwork in your office when the noble patrician sees over Jupiter appears at the door, swaying slightly and stinking of booze. They are all drunkards. <laughs> Come oh, on, no. Jupiter. <laughs> um, your majesty? So sorry to speak to you in this, this condition. <laughs> Night Blue above you fool, to... you're drunk. Drunks that... are so fun to voice act. Let me get you a glass of water. Uh, whiskey is it a shame? I don't know what you do. Anyway. It's just she tell you if the Archbishop asked you about what happened to his head, tell him I'll pay for you. <laughs> oh no. I was desperate and the privy was occupied. <laughs> <laughs> also, that is a great drunk voice. <laughs> Hold on, please let me get a screenshot of this real quick so I can send it directly to Jupiter. <laughs> I, I'll take I'm a screenshot a of the screen game too. Got it. I'm taking a screenshot of this and I'm posting it to Twitter as an announcement for <laughs> hey, join Luna stream. <laughs> Poor, poor Pope, poor Archbishop. I've just sent it to Jupiter with the with the message. You shit in the Pope's hat. <laughs> <laughs> I'll send you a video. I find helpful for growling for you to check off the stream. Thank you. <laughs> this is too funny. Well, the we just like to have fun, occupied. okay? <laughs> they stumble away, knocking over a priceless vase. You make a mental note for, to charge them for the damage. Pay up. <laughs> Whoops. It's surely not a coincidence that the Archbishop arrives at your throne room the next day, looking even grumpier than usual, and hatless. Your Majesty, there's a plague affecting the kingdom, a curse more powerful than any wizard could cast. I speak, of course, of alcohol. <laughs> oh no, you wanted- the prohibition never worked, my guy. People are spending their evenings in ill houses rather than in prayer. We must ban this vile vice. Oh boy. 
<laughs> we have a chance to lower the faith. <laughs> Vizzy, you know what we yeah. have to do. Yeah. Um, you guys all want to go want to vote for no laws. No such laws will be passed, huh? Um, I would really like to limit the opening hours of the tavern. You, you, you guys, you guys don't want to want to go for that? No. no mm. But Martin, do we vote C or A? Which are you thinking? It depends on if what law Luna decrees. Because if Luna goes for reverse here, we have to. Oh, it. <laughs> dang it! They, they got <laughs> onto me. That we need we to run through many it. times. Now we're watching. Hey, hey, hey! hey. Okay. Everyone, vote A. Vote A. B, please. A. B, please. Oh, no, my hands hands B, B, oh my God! Oh, this is such a tragedy. Oh, I, I would really B. love. Reckless oh, drunkard! You shall A. fall off your ship once more. <laughs> And I'll do the hell check whilst you guys vote. So just... I shall push you off the boat myself <laughs> if I have to. Oh no! Oh, oh Silva, will your hands also slip? This is such a pity. Oh, oh, oh my... please. Also, a reminder: if anyone is wanting to join votes and stuff, if you've not put exclamation mark join first, you have to do that first. Yeah, exclamation mark join. Then you can. Well, it looks like A is winning. So. Oh, choo choo. Yeah, because I think I saw Crossella there try to vote, but I don't think they're in anybody's thing right now. Uh. Well, that, uh -oh. that's the fate going down. That's that's the uh, the Northerners. Uh, the Ninth God will judge this captain soul, for it condemns so many of his worshippers to temptation. Listen, I want the other thing. I, I, I don't I have... I just noticed he doesn't have his hat anymore. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't. Yeah. Inappropriate yeah. magic. The gladiators will oh, no. leave you to sleep. Oh no, Alicia! <laughs> no! <laughs> what happened to Alicia? <laughs> what yeah, the fuck? Help me. Do you know how to make a French accent, Martin? <laughs> I've got no fucking clue. Also, shoot, I forgot to ask. Am I allowed to swear here? Like, yeah, swearing. go ahead. Okay. okay. <laughs> I don't I'm swear. Oh myself. yeah, I, I have trouble stopping myself. <laughs> I, I am I might not swear, but I allow everyone else to. <laughs> like, you don't have to stop because I don't. This is just not part of my regular vocabulary. Mm -hmm. Come to Scotland; it will be part of your vocabulary for a week. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. I've, I've been oh, no. cursed, whether in a way trans rights to blame. <laughs> uh, of course, <laughs> it's always trans rights. Huh? <laughs> You oh no! <laughs> <laughs> a fucking dress rights to blame on people! Oh, oh no, they're they're JK Rowling! <laughs> <laughs> That's another one to screech up. God, I wish, I wish you had a quote bot because that would be amazing. I guess we just have to write it down somewhere and then add it once I figure out the quoting. <laughs> Skeleton of my dress, right? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I need a moment. <laughs> Got the they could not look. Yeah. I didn't expect Pesto Spell to do that. What did you expect? <laughs> anyway, Alicia stole my prized uh, attention toothbrush last week, and I only wanted to give them a toothache. Damn. <laughs> That's one heck of a toothache. <laughs> <laughs> Unimaginable pain. Please, by the gods, make it stop. Oh no! Acts of my ancestors. This cannot go unpunished, your highness. Yeah, turning something someone into a skeleton over a toothbrush is a little much. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she dead! A moment later, oh, Alicia's great. skull falls off and they collapse onto the floor in a pile. Alicia's dead! <laughs> Alicia the second has joined the council! <laughs> Welcome in, Alicia the second. 
Um. Oh God. I you know, mean, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. Because I want her belt, I kind of want to do nothing. You, you okay, guys, is, I mean, you are like now progressing in your thing. You have lowered faith enough, but um, yeah, you are like one defines away from the rebelling. I'm gonna, vote a. I'm gonna vote A for like make them have to give up the apprenticeship. Or you guys can do nothing, and we can keep the wizard on the council. Oh my god! We can keep we can keep the wizard man on the council. Look, is it a good I idea? Probably not, would. but it'd be very funny. I wish for you all to be able to rebel. For my sister's sake. Okay, but <laughs> wizard on the council. <laughs> wizard on the council. <laughs> <laughs> the counts all united. I was like, wizard <laughs> right. Should I love how we better well try accidentally using their new powers to kill Militia. <laughs> I mean, I didn't mean to. Totally not. To think upon you. Why are you a skeleton? <laughs> Oh, farce. That was murder. Plain and simple. Yeah, they're... Oh, 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 come on. Nor, that happens Nor. to the best of us. Nor, we need to vote for Rebel. Polsko, it was not murder. I did not kill them. The Decay did. <laughs> but the older nobles look away and shrink under Tob Polsko's gaze. No one wants to anger someone with trans rights power. Even if, <laughs> if they're still a <laughs> mere apprentice. <laughs> I'm so sorry! <laughs> what American right oh, is afraid of? Do they have spells? I need to say this. It is so funny that trans rights became the wizard and has now caused this. I am so happy. Yeah, this is great! <laughs> <laughs> so that is how he aligns with the seagulls. <laughs> it all makes sense now. <laughs> Shall I do the voice of Laura Lai for a moment? Oh no, I think I'm good. Okay. I think I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh. Uh, great greetings, Luna. I I've had an idea. As you know, the people of the East are quite pious. As a member of the royal household, I'm avid. I'm an avid adherent to, of the church myself. I thought I might go back to my homeland for a time and take the opportunity to preach in your favor. No. Hmm. Oh, you treacherous bitch! I feel like she might be insulted if I ask her why do this for me. Also, look at there's a little heart on her on her on her bow here. Look at that. She's cute. So cute. I mean, make me some kind adorable. of saint. Not exactly. I mean, unless they really start liking you, but support from the church can't be a bad thing, can it? I want to encourage her. Aww. Yeah. Support. Please fill the faith. Please fill the Most faith. Most pleasing. I'll make preparations immediately. <laughs> Word spreads fast that the Queen's Consort oh, is planning a tour of the East. Thousands yeah, no. flock to the towns and villages when she, where she plans to stop. Yeah, that feels more like narration than yeah. her speaking. Oh, weird. Yeah. It's just that she's also there. <laughs> Unfortunately, they're mostly flocking to throw vegetables oh. to... Popularity of the church in the East clearly didn't amount as much as- Oh no! Lorelai! My stability! Lorelei. You did your best! My, 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 no, poor lady! Okay, you guys mind if I make a quick scene of this? <laughs> Go ahead. It's the Lord coming up to her. Lorelai, darling, you've been gone for too long. We need the gods no longer. Return to your mistress. Whoa! We are literally married! <laughs> also, I gotta say this in Dutch. How for my Julie idiota? Oh ho ho ho! <laughs> it's not long before she calls off the tour and to return home. Her tail tucked between her, like, no! Aww. Aww. Oh! Lord, how could you do that to her? He's so sweet! 
Wow, you guys are monsters. Sweethearts don't last long in this environment. Norton Saga, Stell of Old Hell's Horn, once gifted to mortals by the honey-blooded prince himself, then lost to the snows of time, never to be found again. Until now. Until now. <laughs> I have it! Old time has spoken! Last night during the storm, I beseeched the drunken vessel himself. And lo, did lightning strike the earth far to the north. That is where we will find the horn. You just were like, go there, my guys. <laughs> Over there. <laughs> <laughs> you mean, into the frozen wastes? Aye. Have everyone muster their, be must muster their best warriors. We're heading into the domain of the ice giants. Oh boy. Ooh. Yeah, their military is already high. Hmm. Whoa. For the next stage of the chief's scheme, they must raise their military to five or more in two seasons. Oh, boy. Well, about that. Oh, yeah, auction time. Well, I think I know what the counts want. Yeah, yeah. I would really love you guys giving yourself more fate. And I would also... Would you mind helping sponsor our observatory this time around? I'll give you a couple hundred for it. Thank I... you. We shan't it, forget it. it. It's uh, oh, it's fun. Yeah, it's fun. And then the my wealth has recently diminished. Letter and then go. the amounts. Fund letter amount. And it's only the um... top two. Oh, slime is going for the military. I like this. You guys don't need more military. I mean, if we rebel... <laughs> it would also be bad. Oh. Uh. Hmm. So, but but how about increasing fate, you guys? How about some C, huh? No? Oops. Yeah, damn. So, lowering fate and lowering farming. Gosh dang it, patricians. And the chiefs are on the verge of rebellion. Although you are, like, continuing with your plan just fine. I know, which is why I'm trying to figure out what I want to do. <laughs> rebellion I mean, is dangerous because you might be, like... There. The, the thing is that the other two factions will have to work against you because they will definitely lose if you win. So it'll be <sighs> two against one. <clears throat> That's not a close one. Yes, though we have the military. All right. For now, we do not rebel. For now. About Which your, all of your air. people just go like, well, about <laughs> that. <laughs> your marriage to Lorelei has grown strong and steady, like an old castle wall. Though it began as a political arrangement, it's blossomed into something like love. Aww. Aww. <laughs> Look at the burbs and the egg. I mean, I know I'm an owl, but... <laughs> yeah, that's how it goes. It's high time you told about an heir. Congratulations are in order. The royal wedding has a the, 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 the royal wedding was a magnificent affair. <laughs> Sorry, I had a little bit of that wine last night. <laughs> <laughs> My pleasure to provide. <laughs> I'm very happy, thank you. Your happiness isn't as important as fulfilling your duty to the kingdom, uh, as fulfilling your duty to the kingdom. But I'm glad you found a way to have both. Gee, thanks, Mom. <laughs> You've done well so far, but something's still missing. An heir. <laughs> I love the way she speaks. <laughs> <laughs> you need someone young, whose loyalty is assured. A child of your own would do the trick, even if they're a bastard. Or the youngest of your many cousins. <laughs> Get to egg production. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I have a bastard child lying around somewhere. <laughs> we can provide oh, several. My wife and I will have a child together. Don't ask me how. <laughs> I mean, we have magic. That is we have thing. magic. It really doesn't. Also, maybe your wife will try. It might just whatever. <laughs> uh, traditional method. No one will object to that. I'll arrange for you to take a month off from ruling, so you can <clears throat> get down to business. To defeat to the Huns. The Huns. 
Um, easing the tension. Your Majesty, nobles of the council, nobles of the council, tensions are running high, but the kingdom itself is stable. Perhaps, perhaps it is time we forgot about forgot our past troubles and come together as friends. <clears throat> what do you have in mind, Chancellor? We could exchange gifts. A fashion show, perhaps. Or a game of riddles. Busy working overtime. You're doing great. <laughs> your Majesty... Uh, oh, wait, that's your you. Your Majesty, I'm... why don't we hold a vote on the team-building exercise to help the council trust each other again? No, no, I don't think trust falls oh. are going to end well. <laughs> yes, just trust fall onto my axe. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, I'm not going to... This like, is a stupid fall. idea. I'm not gonna trust fall to VZ that like requires me to turn his back, my, my, my back to him, so... so. I'm not carrying a knife right now. I'm carrying um, a rapier. So, you guys maybe wanna do like an exchange of gifts or nah? I don't. Gift I don't gifts. trust. I'm alright with gifts. Gifts are quite nice. I don't know what you guys are gonna do. Like, I don't I'm. Know either. I'm not sure if I... Even to myself. I'm not sure if I should, like, veto something or if I should save that for something more important. <laughs> Good question. Yeah. Should the people execute your daughter? Hey! Oh, no, this is where I really wish I had my veto power. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know, you guys can... Yes. You, 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 I'm I'm sure you guys will agree. This is our first trust oh, for, thing. Vote it, stupid. We need to rebel. <laughs> you guys are already rebelling. Yes, exactly. More rebellion. <laughs> Which is oh, an exchange of gifts, life, yeah. or I guess a game of riddles. Just steal my money, will you? Steal all of it. <laughs> you know what? Yes, please. Not a hard I mean, if idea. you insist. Oh boy, there goes my money. <laughs> so that's a good point. We can bankrupt you. Yeah, you can bankrupt True. me. Plus, the North are not going to win any riddles, so that will make us more rebellious. <laughs> you are a rather... Um, yeah, continue that. ...whipped folk for riddles. Damn. Wonderful, I'll make the arrangements at once. The nobles can work together on the riddles with a hefty cash prize if they get it right. Oh, wait, working together... Ugh. The nobles of the council begin murmuring. This is a chance to prove the sharpness of their wits. They better brush up on their riddles. Ah, let's keep them busy with riddles so they can't rebel. I see. <laughs> the harvest in the east have been utterly disaster. Has been an utter disaster. Look at the turnips. No Don't point that thing at me. <laughs> Look at it. Do you see this turnip? Okay, let me take a look. The turnip is riddled mm. with fraud and twisted into the grotesque shape of a skull. Oh, lovely. Oh, ominous. There's only one power to rival magic and it's best. money. I'd like to point out, in spite of this, our farming is the best in the lands. Yeah, and we really yeah. need to get that up to stop the patricians. Oh, Come no, on, it's oh, no oh, longer oh, high. Oh, never mind. It's, it's still bad. Half of our harvest is like this. We need help if we are to get through the winter! Yeah, I don't think the other guys are in much better shape, but... <laughs> this is probably nothing to worry about! Oh, farming is too low for the other guys, damn. I should have kept my uh, call for unity uh, for this. Wow, this is, this is terrible either way. Yeah! Yeah. I... Listen, we all just need to, like... Set our belts a little tighter. It's good for the waistline. Come on. Yeah, I should have I saved have my call for unity for, for this. <laughs> I mean... I wish to glutton myself and then snatch my waist with a corset. It's simple. Ah, uh, it will be a good lesson in discipline. We all need that, right? right? We can at least ask the university. You certainly need it, knowing your tradition with alcohol. <laughs> Damn. 
I find it crazy that both of these have the same outcomes. Yeah, it's just farming is too low, so we we can't. Yeah. This is fine. Yeah, it's just a little starvation. Yeah, come on, everyone can do a little starvation a little... sometimes. Yeah. Like, everyone should experience it once. Yes. The peasants are going to get a bit uppity with how much we drain from them all of a sudden. It's the right? There goes my stability. <clears throat> By Sensha's ashes, we need grain, not wizened old men looking. Wait, hold on. S Senya. By Senya's ashes, we need grain, not wizened old men to look at our blighted crops and mumble to each other about weather patterns. You send a fleet of scholars from the university to examine the fields in the east. Whether or not the mystery is solved, a bleak winter lies ahead. Yep, yeah, well, the patricians have their way. Everyone is starving. We're lacking wine. It's okay, we will just sort that out after yeah. the, the bee business has been Yeah, done. so the counts have their low fate, the patricians have their low farming, and uh, the, the chiefs of the Be north gone. have their military. <laughs> yeah, the golden are the bees. Whispers rise in the east of secret society gathering shrouded in mystery. In the abandoned tower beneath a pale moonlight, one such meeting begins. Uh, Martin, would you do me the honors? Ah, oh, yes. Another priest left my estate today. He said there was no sense preaching to the truly lost. Um, how dramatic. Well, I've heard the same across these. We are no longer trapped under the church's thumb. Now we must not falter. If the queen grows proud, we can offer her the ultimate reward. Immortality. Yeah, I feel like I'm going to be stern into a statue or something. <laughs> I'm just calling it now. Monkey spa. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I know how this goes. For the next stage oh. of their scheme, the Counts must raise a tor a tory to five or more in three seasons. Well... Ah. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> well, then. Well, all of our schemes are going great. That's fun. Oh no, the bees. The bees. Along the coast, noble patrician Willcraft is visiting the wizard Scrampton in his cliffside tower, built of knotted coral and seashells. Oi. <clears throat> Your side of the bargain is complete. The dreams of being are no longer a threat. This place stands empty. Being. I grant your navy favorable winds and forgiven tides. Oh. That's you, Ten. Oh, wow! Uh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I was staring at the bees. <laughs> As one does. <laughs> you, just, you rarely see them these days. I don't know what's yeah, where did they go? <laughs> My th thanks, Great Wizard. Now, shall we discuss how to overthrow this troublesome queen? Oh, it's a vote. It's a vote. Oh my god. Okay, it's a patrician vote. Um. Oh no, one of them is to raise stability. Yeah, yeah, let's but... do that, actually. Wait, not... I mean, okay. I mean, uh, anyway, it doesn't really matter that much. We're doing good on both. Yeah, trade, so... you're also doing good. Really just... No older patricians right now? Well, whatever. No, there's, there's moderate. There is an absolute monarchy going on here. Yeah, I'm, I'm giving a couple more seconds for the older patricians to catch on. Yeah, Mordred is a... Uh, Adam came up. So, Neset, Stormbeat, oh, David, Will, uh, Atomikos, and Seas over Jupiter. Yeah, Atomikos, that's yeah. Adam. That's uh, my mate. Ye. He was, he was a guest at my place two years ago now. Oh, that's neat. Yeah. So, you're gonna raise stability, which I, I want high too, so this is not... Hmm. 
far, far away that can be done, I'll steal the queen away through the apiary, where distance works differently. Oh, you get to travel through the dream world. That's so cool. Yay! And kind of on theme. Like, I, I like that that is my scheme this time. Yeah, honestly, that fits you very well. But the apiary is a land of dreams, and in times of turbulence, nightmares, it must be peaceful for him to nav navigate it very far. Yes, that can be done. We'll make sure the kingdom's as peaceful as a sleeping lamb and everyone's dreaming pleasant dreams. That is quite the promise. For the final stage of their scheme, the patricians must raise their stability to at least seven. Well, oh, we can we're... do that. You're more confident than I am. Uh, okay, so I need you guys to not rebel. <laughs> you guys can pay a little extra. We have recently sure? lost our fortune. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, most... Only Crossella has a lot of money from you guys. I have no money. Yeah, well, you shouldn't have betted your entire I life know, savings. I have some money. Um, the problem is if I do this, then you guys are... going to be able to rebel. Um... Yeah. Hmm. It's it's very on brand. I have no money. There'd Please, be, like four four richest people. <laughs> yeah, that is very on brand. I think I might need to get some money from you, but also I don't really want you guys to be able to. Although you have. Mm -hmm. I mean, we don't have that much of a military. It's fine, really. I mean, yeah, but it's still. I think I'll do this. Mm, true will. Yeah. We shan't forget this. Yeah. So the chiefs of the north are still on the verge of rebellion. Oh no, blood money. That can't be good. Let's go for the game of riddles first. <laughs> Your majesty, I've asked the court jester to help us with our game of riddles. Who wants to be the jester? Also, look at them. They're so cool. I think maybe it should be someone who isn't Vizzy, considering Vizzy's already pulling overtime. <laughs> I, can, I can do it. Yeah, go for it. Fiddle dee dee, fiddle dee dum. Let's test our wits and have some fun. I <laughs> love him! <laughs> that is amazing. <laughs> oh, oh no. Jester! <laughs> nah, I'm. Oh, I'll... I'll... three. It's three <laughs> leprechauns in a suit. <laughs> Oh, I'll back him up. Oh, Delightful. No. <laughs> Rivi, what walks on four legs in the... <laughs> man. It's man. <laughs> Damn. Get some new ones. By the ninth. That was an easy one. You're canny riddles after all. Have pity on this poor old fool. <laughs> But since the council's mood is knife funeral funeral what funeral But since the council's mood is knife funeral I shall break out some new material Oh oh no the monkey ball girls <laughs> something tells new me stuff. new stuff new <laughs> stuff Over the next hour the jester capers around the council hall Posing riddles and occasionally hitting Chief Marlock with an inflated pig ladder on a stick. <laughs> Finally, he sings out the final and most difficult riddle of all. I am a beast that swallows many a man. The more heads I grow, the stupider I am. Without me, barbs weep and kiss king's frown. To find me, visit your nearest town. Huh. What am I? Ah, oh, guys. Oh. What am oh. I? Something that rhymes with cake, something that rhymes with coward, something that rhymes with cruel, something that rhymes with cloud. Oh. I don't even know what this is. Beast that I swallow many a man, more heads I grow, the stupider I am. What am I? Uh, no, no, no. The... Makes the absence or the being there, Bart's cry. 
Bar's cry and noble and king's frown. To find me, to find me visit town. your nearest town. Yeah. Uh, I must translate something to Dutch whilst you guys think about this. A crowd. It's also, yeah. Yeah, that's but, probably it. The more heads, the I, I was, I was nooit en lift. Ze zijn altijd. Words uh, that describe groups of people eat. and didn't find it, but yeah, 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 that's it. Dus ze moeten ze altijd zorgen dat we ze vermijden. <laughs> There we go. Uh, it doesn't make as much sense in Dutch as it does in English. I was thinking power. No, no, no. It's like it's a group of people, right? So crowd, crowd, probably, yeah. Yeah, crowd. So it would rhyme with cloud. Yeah. Yeah. Like a mob. Yeah, it sounds good. I mean, this is a perfect time to go for Call for Unity, but at the same yeah. time... Yeah, I don't want to raise the stability too much. We yeah. all want to get the right answer anyway, so... Yeah. Wait, do we? The funny yeah. thing would be to just fucking veto the right <laughs> answer. No, I, I want to get this right. I want to see what happens. <laughs> um, Do I want to help raise the stability, though? That's the question. No. <laughs> Probably not, huh? I'll just... What? No? D don't you want... Isn't that your, like, thing? It is, but it also is what you guys are gonna use to throw me out, like... I mean, yeah, we've already thrown you. Power, right? We do not wish to throw you. You have been a very good queen, as a matter of fact. I applaud your efforts. Yeah. I like living. <laughs> living is good. Uh, Mr. Alec, to... To have, have your you ever... vote count, you'll have to uh, do exclamation mark, uh, join first. Mm -hmm. My queen, have you ever thought about the fact that eventually, as sorrowful as it may be, life has to end? Um, Luna? Yeah? Did you consider that if we're successful, stability might still go up? No. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> What say you, your majesty? Does thou agree with thine council members? I think they're correct. Wise you are indeed, I must humbly concede. The answer is, a crowd. Hey, we figured it out! Whoop whoop! The council's wisdom has left me in awe. And what's more, it's left the queen poor! Oh, <laughs> shoot! <laughs> My money! <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought earlier when you said, I want to see what happens. I, I was thinking, you're, you're gonna lose your money, is what's happening. <laughs> yeah, I forgot that I was gonna pay you guys money for this. <laughs> the Jester card pulls out of the council hall, leaving the nobles to celebrate their victory and sharing their cash prize amongst themselves. You know, hmm. There you go, Vizzy. You, you have some money again. Finally, a return on investment. Yeah, like speaking of it, blood money. <laughs> Hmm. Excuse me? <sighs> nothing is wrong. Absolutely nothing is wrong in the East. <laughs> really? Because you look like... Yeah. You got me like you swallowed the wasp. One of those I'm fine people, uh. huh? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna do this one. There is definitely not an old <laughs> witch who lives on the borders of my land, and I definitely haven't <laughs> been having money problems. <laughs> yeah, you know I'm aware that you bet your entire life savings on a boat race, right? <laughs> and most importantly, she didn't, she didn't offer me a fortune in exchange for just a drop of my blood, an offer which I absolutely didn't accept. Oh boy, you gave oh, your blood to a yeah, witch. Yeah, that's, that's probably good. <laughs> That you didn't. <laughs> Great stuff, where's my wine? You keep looking at me like I've trot on your foot. Ever since I didn't accept the witch's bargain, I haven't found myself obeying her every command. I definitely still rule over my estate, not her. Oh boy. Furthermore, She didn't forbid me from telling you any of this, and I am not using negative statements to bypass her magic. I mean, pretty clever. Smart, yeah. 
<laughs> Hang on, I'm starting to think you mean the opposite of what you say. Wow. <laughs> Glad that it's all cleared up. Let's celebrate <laughs> with all good news with some wine. I could finally bring the farming up, but I don't need that anymore. Um, yeah, let's say, fetch the court physician. See if we can... And we don't need farming up anymore. I need the uh, chief's military down. I need my authority down. And I need my stability down, even though... And that's also something I wanted to keep up for myself, but I need to have it not be high now. After a week confined to a cold iron box with nothing to eat but salt, the magic stops affecting Count Vizzy so strongly. He's even able to talk about his ordeal directly. I always tolerated that bloody witch. She'd sell medicine to the peasants and help them find lost sheep. I never suspected she was capable of something like this. Uh huh. The queen cares not for the famine ravaging our lands. No, it's not in my best interest now. Sorry. We need to call a vote. Send a regiment to take back my stolen lands. I think you sold that with a drop of blood. I was given a drop, giving a drop of blood. That's yeah, and. Doing. Yeah, you gave a drop of blood for money. You sold it. Yes, I was given money for the blood. Nothing more. Um... I'm vetoing that. I don't want to spend all that money. Put it away. I mean, we have a military. You can... Like... Fight the witch, maybe. I mean, we have a 60%, so no guarantee, but... But, no. <laughs> we only okay. want wizards here. Adam, how dare you? <laughs> I like Mordred go doing hashtag Mordred for leader. Try to overthrow Vizzy. <laughs> I mean, he did sell his lands to a witch, so, you know. I never sold my lish. Wait. Listen. I never sold my lands. They were wrongfully taken. Yeah. Our magic using the people as much as the next person. I just want to make the world a safer place. Well, we failed. <laughs> <laughs> when the Eastern troops arrive on Count Vizzy's estate, the land itself fights them. The soil swallows them whole. Trees snatch them up and tear them apart. By the time they fight their way through the manor, the witch has already escaped. Along what? With what remains of Vizzy's gold, and there your gold goes again. <laughs> Once again, Vizzy is poor. <laughs> you really need to be more mindful of your money, my guy. <laughs> Perhaps. But thankfully, we got a glorious queen on our side. Oh, the farming! <laughs> the peasants have no memory of their time under the witch's rule, but the churches have been burned, with profane messages scrawled on their charred halls, and the fields have been sown with salt. Our... Fucking fangle rot moment. <laughs> yeah. Our country is like dying. Like, we have so low farming. Everyone is. We're gonna have a famine. That's. Yikes. The Long March North. I think they're. Hmm? Oh, they're gonna. Tell me, have you ever heard of Old Hell's Horn? A Northern legend, right? The Horn of Old Held is indeed a northern legend, a horn gifted to mortals before the Ninth Triumph, during the Cursed Age. The Queen might actually be brilliant, no people to rebel if they all starve, that's not really what I want. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, your point? You must understand, whether it's a creation of a pagan spirit or not, the horn is real, my sources confirm it. It's said to have the power to destroy any fortification with a single toot. <laughs> the... <laughs> Alright, just going, what? And the entire wall goes down is a very funny image. <laughs> I just imagine it being a kazoo. <laughs> what? <laughs> the chiefs are searching for it in the frozen wastes, having received, uh, received a sign hinting at its location. The toot of <laughs> doom! <laughs> You mean where the ice giants live? Precisely. 
We'll need to stop them before they retrieve it, if at all possible. Yeah, that's going to be hard. They have a strong military. And we need it to be... Five. Or uh, it needs to be at least five. So you need to drop we... it by three points. Yeah, I need it to be four to not have that happen. They've gathered a great host of warrior heroes for the journey to the wastes. We must act fast to have any hope in stopping them. You hastily assemble the council to deal with the chief's military buildup. The chiefs, predictably, deny everything. You would dare deny us our right to blame ourselves for the ice giants? Ah! Okay. We so northern people, we cannot let A win. But if Luna reverses it, we need to vote for A. Ah, oh, but B's also. We need C to win. Yeah, you guys need C to win. Everyone else needs to not have that. I... So... Okay. So the Counts need the authority to be 5 or higher, which for them to not win, we want that to not happen. So in that case, we they, uh, they want not A, but probably B, so they can win before the Chiefs do. But the Patricians probably would want A, so that the Counts don't win before them. And uh, the Chiefs don't win. Yeah, the Counts don't win. The, the Chiefs would want C. So y'all want something else. Please. I can tell. Have fun. It's reverse voting. It's reverse voting. Vote for A. Voting A. Fizzy, you don't want that. Fizzy, that's against what the Counts want because it will lower authority. But. You or no. voting. Oh yeah, that that's true. Even I forgot that's that. What I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well it seems I'm going to be pushed back for one season because nobody has voted for the public mansion, so that's going to win. Yeah. Uh, hey, at least that'll that'll buy you're, me time. You're sneaky. You clicked on that so fast. <laughs> she, she was so sneaky, but she forgot. Yeah, I was like, wait yep. a second. <laughs> Busy, why are you voting like that? Yeah. I'm on to your schemes. It's like, oh wait, my <laughs> schemes. <laughs> the schemes that I put in place. The schemes to I stop mean, them from schemes. <laughs> your ban helps slow the tide of warriors joining the expedition in the north, as the word of the medical horn is stifled. It will be some time before the chiefs can set out on their journey north, but the delay is not permanent. The chief's stat goal will not be evaluated until the end of next season. Versus. <sighs> if I had got it this season. By royal decree, we can tweak laws governing the council votes. We can't pass more than three of these laws at once, and only one may be used per vote. Hmm. No, I think I'm going to keep what I have now, because I think being able to call for unity to raise my stability once I want to is is good. Yeah, golden choice, but then I can make you guys do maybe what I want, but also that's no guaranteed. Reverse voting has served me well and veto is very strong, and I think I want to keep call for unity, maybe. Reverse voting has been way more powerful than it has any right to, and it speaks oh, yeah. to our illiteracy. Yeah, I think I'm keeping what I have now. Famine, yeah, that's a new wizard and new discovery. Okay, let's check out what the wizard's up to, huh? The, the problem when you have your eyes on the prize is that you can't see when there's suddenly a tripping hazard in the... <laughs> a new wizard has risen in the north, your majesty. It's trans right! <laughs> Pestinus, <laughs> former acolyte. Nice. <laughs> they completed their apprenticeship in record time. Usually it takes years to master magic. If the apprentice survives, that is. They've devoted themselves to mastering turnip magic and have taken to Val <laughs> Valamir in search of new treasures and secrets. So that's Trans why the rights now commands the turnips. <laughs> so that's why the turnips were all. Oh, hey! Yay, let's 
not starving anymore. <laughs> Yay, trans rights saved our the farms. Not before using the power to mass germinate a whole valley of new crops. Well, turnips. I mean, the turnips were, <laughs> were failing. <laughs> so we, we, we return up the turnips. Oh, why? <laughs> Well, I think it's time for an eternity. tech. <laughs> no, we're not going to do that. We did say that they would look after the, the people, but... I love unrestricted magic. Wizards aren't much for sentiment, so it may be a parting gift to the former homeland of the East. Perhaps they felt a sense of duty. Aww. Regardless, the fields of the east are ne have never been better. Well, that's just I a mean, fucking lie. Yeah, they used to be. They used to be better than this. <laughs> so famine. famine. <laughs> uh, hello, your Majesty. I've traveled all the way from the east to beg you to do something about the price of grain. But you have turnips now. Oh, there goes our stability. I can't uh. afford to feed my family. A day, a day of backbreaking work isn't enough to buy a day's worth of bread. She's right. Uh, Mordred, are you there? Mordred. <laughs> Rain, let Mordred. them eat turnip. <laughs> let them eat turnips. <laughs> what voice do you want? Yeah, Actually, if we're gonna have to wait, I do need another, uh, like, rewatering because my bottle is empty. What? Yeah, go for it. What kind of voice do you want me to use, Mordred? I'll, uh, yeah, I can't. Be I right can't back. believe Luna would just let her stability crush like that. It's really not like her. I can't well, believe I denied a turn. It is no <laughs> need. Do not worry, Martin. I have you a turn, Ip, but it's a turnip. <laughs> Gremlin energy. <laughs> all right, all right, I got you. I got you covered, my friend. I got you quite covered. She's a great person. This is beyond all control. Greedy merchants make profit while covered from starve. Okay, yeah, so I think I have found the voice that we are going to use for this character. I do I do believe that we have found it. Needs a kick, 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 laugh. Alright. <laughs> He's right. The grain price in the east is beyond This is just becoming an insane person. <laughs> Are you uh, going? Are you all right being the insane person, Mordred? <laughs> An absolutely crazed, mad person. Moonfire and s'mores. <laughs> all right. All right. So arson. I'm making them an arsonist in this. I'm gonna figure out how I'm gonna make them an arsonist. Are you aware of Mordred's uh, other title, by the way? No. The King of Dragons. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Check us out. I will see if I can work that in in some way. <laughs> I'm gonna be I would honest. love if Mordred tried to burn something down at some point. <laughs> Coming into this two and a half hours in is a learning curve. Yeah, but I have returned. Welcome yeah. back. Like, so, so I I checked in with Luna b before, and like I can stick around for like three or four p.m. Hmm. I can hang around for quite a while. So yeah. Yeah, I will be taking like a lunch break at twelve, like usual, and I hopefully we can finish this game at least, and if. Yeah. Either of you like have to like dip halfway through. That's fully understandable. <laughs> I, I yeah, got no we'll, we'll plans see. for you today. Oh, well, she, <laughs> she's right. The grain prices in the east are beyond all control. Greedy merchants are breaking the profit of the, well, the common folk star. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Treasure is too low. I'm too poor. Prices of the east. Hmm. 
strange. Perhaps we could simply set it all on fire. <laughs> oh, Let's not do that. Oh. Um, lower stability. Huh. We can almost bankrupt you. Yeah, you can. Um... I love the fact that what should be done about the rising price of grain in the East? Import grain from the East and distribute it for free. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, that's because, like, the East is the highest, I think. Yeah. In, like, it's like, it'll choose the highest. It's, like, not accounting for the fact that um, East no longer the is. The famine is in the East. Yeah. <laughs> the famine in the other place is even worse, but we aren't hearing from that. The peasants have already died. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I really rather not be bankrupted. Oh. Hopefully that won't bite me, but... Come on, we can... we can help a fellow out, it's... We, we can be not heartless sometimes. Or we put a cap on the price of grain, because I have... even though I wanted to go for stability, I became very authoritative. <laughs> it is nearly a 50-50. It's a 50-50 again. Man, then I get to decide. Last vote, come on. And I get to decide. No. <laughs> yeah, so I'm gonna go for this because I don't really want more defiance. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm for that actually. Success. Oh, there we thank their trade. You place a strict price cap on grain. When the wily merchants find a way around it, you order a few of them hanged as an example to the rest. Damn. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, that does increase stability. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, this short, yeah. sharp lesson does wonders. Soon enough, grain is cheap again, and no merchant dares to say a word. Hopefully, most of the peasants will stay alive until next harvest. We increased the farming, and the stability is now stable. They need it a lot higher, though. And I need authority yeah. to be a lot lower, and their military to be a lot lower. Let's see, what did you guys discover? Sweet dreams, never so threatening before. The scholars she sent to investigate the strange harvest in the east have finally returned. I guess I can take care of this one. Or, Danny, you want uh, want to take one? Oh god. <clears throat> wait, wait, let me, let me just one second mute myself. Sweet dreams are made of these. Who am I to disagree? Okay, I think I can do this. <laughs> Go for it. All our tests came back negative. The blighted fields were dozens of miles apart, often with completely different crops. We only found one thing in common. Yes? The plowshares. They were all forged from the iron from the same mine. Owned by Con Transrate. <laughs> <laughs> but, but that couldn't be the cause. It's impossible. Dang, the wizard at it again. <laughs> You both, <laughs> both ends better take a look at this iron, don't you think? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I'm not sure we should fetch the wizard. <laughs> you know, I think the wizard would be kind of peeved to be interrupted. Let's just... Especially as they're on their way out. Yeah. They, they, they like, reinvigorated the crops and then we dragged them back. Let, let's just look at the iron, huh? Yes, your majesty. Good idea, your majesty. <laughs> well, I, uh, hmm. In the north, unbeknownst to the rest of the kingdom, a great battle has just taken place. Naturally, the chiefs are celebrating their recent victory against the ice giants in the frozen waste by smashing steins together and singing battle songs all throughout the night. Did you see that giant's face when I caught him doing? Poor blight, I've never seen a hated axe before. <laughs> so much loot, never mind the horn, look at all this gold. Oh no, they're rich now too. 
<laughs> maybe some noble set fell off. I don't understand why everyone is afraid of wizards. Just because maybe some nobles handle. Yeah, you only turn someone into a skeleton. <laughs> the party lasts long into the night. A few chiefs take turn drinking meat out of Odell's horn. As dawn breaks, they stumble into the main hall where Chief Yora has beckoned them. How is it that everyone except we are the drunkers when we consume so much wine? <laughs> it's not actually wine. <laughs> I it down, you louts. It's time to be serious. This one has the power to collapse buildings, cause earthquakes, even destroy mountains. You must vote on how it'll be used. Hey, didn't you mention one time that you don't drink wine? Well, chiefs, time to vote. <laughs> oh, lower orders farming, lower authority. Wanna dr directly fight against the counts? Fuck it. Chiefs, chiefs, chief vote. Either way, I'm chief, fighting against them, vote. because if I have to lower authority, I'm fighting against Vizzy. Yeah. If I have to lower farming, I'm fighting against Vizzy. Well, no, nobody wants farming. Yeah, I don't want farming. I'm just the best at it. All you're fighting well, is my vanity. I guess we're lowering authority because my own people just voted against me. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm fine with infighting. That's only good for me. Whoops. Hey, and you're gonna try and make the palace, like, collapse on my head, so... Yes. <laughs> Squimsh. <laughs> A bit too sneaky for my liking, but I'll get the job done. We'd best make sure the security is lax enough for us to sneak in. I'm sure we can convince the Queen to relax a few restrictions here and there. I was too late, I'm sorry. For the good of I... the realm, of course. <laughs> of course! <laughs> of course! I realize something. One of the fucking plot lines from this kingdom is trans rights turned a French rebellionist from the north into a skeleton, so they had to be succeeded by their heir. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. This game is amazing. Truly. This game is Europe amazing. Has fallen. <laughs> yeah, so. Both the chiefs and the uh, patricians are very far. Um, like, if either of them gets to their thing, like, they will succeed. So, if stability gets too high or authority gets too low, they will be able to proceed to their next thing. Um, the counts are probably going to be there very soon, because if... Yeah, I think, like, ending this season is gonna do it. Yeah, so then you Let's all will be at level 3 of your thing, and you will only need one more thing done. So depending on what the counts have to do next, um, like you're all so neck and neck. If all of us have the same goal, I wonder what would happen. Mm. It is funny to me that if Vizzy goes... If we get the offer at down to 5, Vizzy does technically move up, but I also move up. Yeah. See, it's 6 for Vizzy. Your quest for an heir is finally complete. You stand before the council, holding a small child in your arms. Should no I die, I ask, <laughs> I ask my crown be passed down to... The council hall is filled with nervous silence. <laughs> my son, my daughter, my child. <laughs> I guess my child. Just, just general. And I guess this will bring up stability, unfortunately. The assembled nobles break out into polite applause by designating an heir who cemented the stability of the kingdom. Your esteemed highness, may I be the first to congratulate you on the birth of your child? What is their name? <laughs> Luna the second. <laughs> <laughs> oh, marvelous, your esteemed highness. I'm sure little Luna the second will grow up to be a chip of the old block. Yeah, non-binary non heir. So this is a child. <laughs> this is a child. Perceive. <laughs> child. Congratulations on finding an heir. Now you just need to fulfill your ambition to win the game. Expect a visit from the spy master. How am I going to do that if the other guys also win with high step? How, we'll how does see. that work? Prying eyes. Oh, no. Oh, I do this one. Yep. Your Grace, you're of course the greatest queen of the century. Oh, I did not. There's... Entirely there. <laughs> Is there something you're after? Your Majesty, I seek only to tell you the truth as I see plain. 
Uh oh. But your powers could be even greater. Unless you're gonna turn me into a wizard. I'm not sure if I'm interested. Death comes for us all, but what if it didn't have to? What if you could be the greatest queen for all millennia? What are you saying there, buddy? Simply that there are opportunities for you to reign beyond what might have been imagined, Your Grace. And I believe you're strong enough to take them. Ah, uh, um, just got an heir. <laughs> <laughs> I can arrange more meetings so that we may discuss this matter further. Hmm. The door bursts open. My <laughs> Inquisitor. <laughs> Ah, so they got to you first. No matter. The Gowns have agents everywhere, and they've been building up your strength, but there's something more sinister afoot. Their ultimate aim is to recruit you into a cult of immortal blood drinker. Huh. Oh. So that's what the why was. Not drink blood. Man, you, you enjoy really... wine. The, the High Inquisitor is really bad at not selling this, like... Yeah. <laughs> mm, don't make it sound so cool. Martin. Oh, sorry. What a tale. All we want is to help the queen. Is this true? Of course not. This is what? heresy of the highest order. The council must know. <laughs> Force the monarch to officially refuse to join the cult. Prevent the counts from seeking private audiences with the queen. Delay his scheme for one season. Leave the counts to their business. So... The chiefs want this. Yep. The patricians would probably want this. And the counts want this one. Um. The question is, are you. What are you gonna do? Yeah, the question is, what do I want? <laughs> hmm. I don't think I want my authority down right now. I mean... <laughs> Sorry. Well, then I, I will, will I will help you thing. later for this, Martin. That's why I'm voting for you. I like the fact that you re- Oh, God. Oh, no, they're turning! Yeah, the patricians- Vote C, everybody. Vote C. Ha <laughs> ha Ah. I appreciate oh, well. your assistance from the north. We shall remember this. How mm. far had the other counts gone? Uh, the counts are behind, so it isn't too bad. Yeah, that's fine. That's yeah. fine. That's all right. I imagine it's like one of the Telltale games. Vizzy will remember this. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> basically. <laughs> the High Inquisitor storms off to her chambers, but there's nothing more she can do against the counts. The philanthropist. Ooh. Your Majesty, we may have a problem in the North, though I'm not sure how much of a problem yet. I mean, there are several problems going on right now. <laughs> Everyone the has a problem. Looming rebellion. <laughs> of course we have a problem. Have you seen the Nord recently? Yes, the place is a mess, but there's a new wrinkle. <laughs> ah, lovely. <laughs> what I know is this. What the... money? <laughs> <laughs> the north is in the middle of a famine. The peasants are starving on their hovels. Even most of the chiefs are eating bread and drinking water. <laughs> They're drinking water. W water. That's stress. <laughs> but Chief, Go <laughs> Chief Google Sands <laughs> is an exception. He's one of the wealthiest nobles in the north, and he's been importing corn from Tavalin in huge quantities. He's distributing it among the peasants for free. <laughs> nice to see the nobles doing something good for one. The common folk now love him as a result. All across the north, peasants are comparing Chief Google Sands to their queen. The comparison's unflattering to you. Oh, hmm. <laughs> I don't know if Chief Google Sands intended for this to happen, but the common folk, and even some of the soldiers, are talking about rising up and putting him on the throne. But that's where I sit. <laughs> <laughs> Indeed, it is, Your Highness. So like, damn, this queen is stupid. 
What do you suggest no I do? No wonder they want to rise up. Yeah, I'm like, okay. Order him to stop distributing food. It's harsh, but it'll nip this in the bud. Or you could use your own funds to mount a relief effort that makes us look piddly in comparison. Yeah, and the funds that I totally have. Of course, you'll need council approval either way. Okay, you should have Chief's Google hands continue feeding the poor, which will reduce wealth, reduce my authority, which... Uh... Damn. Okay, assemble the council. Honorable nobles of the council, I beseech you, let me continue my good work. All I do is feed the starving hungry because the queen was letting them starve. What authority oh, do we want? That's a good one. Again? We need a, four, we need a 45, exactly. Yeah. So like, go for A, we can go for... Oh, wait, hold on. Don't put a pre-vote in yet because I see that Luna still has reverse voting. Yeah, no, I'm not tossing any glove down. You want five or higher, I want five or less. Yeah, so like, the lowering the here is there. not going to be terrible. Yeah, exactly. If it goes to six, it's still good for you. Yeah. I feel bad wanting B, but I kind of need B. It's reverse. It's reverse. Yeah, vote for B. Vote B. Everyone vote <laughs> B. It's reversed. I saw Luna click it. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't getting away with it no longer, wench. <laughs> oh damn! Oh what? <laughs> Should have called for unity. Damn. <laughs> no, because it would have increased stability and lost the game immediately. Although funny, if this drops a forty by two, I think I win. Yeah. Let's find out. Chief Google Hands uh, continues to distribute corn from Tavlin. The peasants, no longer on the brink of starvation, can focus on plowing the fields. Oh no, it's exactly five! <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> Meanwhile, even the nobles gossip about how Chief Google's hands succeeded where the queen failed. Oh no, that's no good for me. Is that that might actually... yeah. While playing a game of chess in those stair castle, two counts of the East discussed their schemes against the crown. Most pleasing, the queen is drunk with power. But I but was, I was thinking... Oh, oh no, well, no, no, yeah, that is you. <laughs> but I was thinking, should we really show the queen the true secrets of our group? Oh man, you're an only fake vampire bee! <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was the point. Immortality and all that. Yes, but those secrets are meant to be, well, kept secrets. What if we pull the wool over her eyes? Dang, you're bait and switching me with vampire promises. <laughs> wow, rude. Treachery is in our nature. Okay, it's a count world. All right. Wow, you're just going to straight up kill me. Or, you're, you, or you have to raise your own farming. So I will actually Dang. be inducted into the real secret. I mean, yeah, the farming is already pretty Yeah. <laughs> yeah counts b is the only real way we are already the turnip lords <laughs> well very well we must prepare the ritual yes i'll begin appeasing the spirits the spirits of the soil. But first we must enrich our lands. More turnips. <laughs> By the blood of the dead, it won't be long now. Yeah, unless they the, the chiefs manage to Yeah, the chiefs might just like flat out win here. We'll see. Make a castle yeah. crumble in my head. Oh, they're farming up to at least nine. Cool. Oh. Uh Oh no! I mean, I hey guys, if we don't lower authority, the Chiefs will win. Okay, let's see this. Um, everyone, fund B. Everyone in the north, please vote B. Or oh, wait, no, raise authority. 
raise authority. We need to raise authority, otherwise the cheese win. I forgot. They need. Yeah, no, we need to not be. Uh, mark one B and all the money you got. Oh boy. And the the counts need C. And the patricians need F. Patricians, I ask you humbly to help fund us just a little bit. Yeah, the counts don't have the monies. Whoops! Oh no! My my hands slipped. All my money <laughs> went away. Whoop. The patricians putting all of their money. It's like ah, this is our time. Ah, <laughs> uh, these things. To be fair, I still have a little bit. Yes, um... I wonder where you got that. <laughs> I am grateful, though. Well, stability is up, which is not good for me, I think. And farming is up, so they're getting close. And the castle might be... Oh no, I think they won. Uh, I think the won. Chiefs won. The council session starts like any other. You're supposed to be debating farming subsidies with Stormbee and older patricians. But the chiefs are nowhere to be seen. Oh no, I'm gonna get a castle on top of my head. <laughs> Anyone seen a few lost chiefs this morning? Probably drunk in a ditch. Please, your esteemed highness. Let us begin without them. I doubt they will have anything useful to contribute anyway. You stand up to address your nobles. Just as you're about to call the council into session, there's a wobble. Not a little wobble, mind you. A this entire building is shaking wobble. Earthquake! <laughs> In the capital? Surely not. But then, what? Before they can say anything more, there's another wobble. This time, it's more violent and loud. The chandeliers jingle, then shake madly. A crack in the masonry appears in the nearby column, then travels up, up all the way to the arched ceiling. The stone column splits, then starts to fall. Your Majesty, watch out! Those are load-bearing columns! Oh no! Stand beneath the pillar. No, dive out of the way? Why would I stand beneath the pillar? Like a tricker? I don't know. You dive. A great slab of stone shatters the marble flooring where you'd be standing a moment ago. Everyone descends into panic, shouting and running for the exit. Only your chief architect stands still, wailing loudly to anyone who will hear. <laughs> the palace! Who could do this to my beautiful palace? Poor <laughs> architect. Like, come on, you should appreciate the art more. <gasps> my child! My child and my wife! I can't leave my child, Aww. but also my wife. But I have, I have to save my child. You rush towards the All stairs, right. ignoring the cries of your nobles and advisors. You have to make sure your heir is safe. The, but, but the palace is still shaking. Just as you're about to climb up the stairs to find Luna the second, there's another rumble from deep below. In the distance, is that the sound of a horn? If we had a kazoo right now. <laughs> Hold on, I've got you. I've got us covered. Sadly, it's a little bit too epic, but you know that fits. <laughs> and thank you for the hydration check. The masonry is coming apart at an alarming rate. Chunks of rock are falling on your head, even as you try to duck and run for cover. That's when it hits you. Actually, that's when two things hit you at once. The first is the realization that the chiefs have un usurped you in the most destructive way possible. The second is a big stone slab. Oh. <laughs> Everything goes dark. I can ask for my mom. What, oh. what now? <laughs> no, mother? When you finally come to, someone has lifted the rubble of your shaking body. Through blurred vision, you make out a figure. Chief Solrock Martin. Martin! <laughs> Oh. Praise Morgana. What? What? They laugh heartily. No. no. You yourself. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Run. Okay, I need to know what. Where's Lorelai? What happened to my child? Oh no. Oh no. I can't believe it. 
Goliath's building's on to get for the health of young children. Shima had to be this way. I stripped through the dream world. To, to be fair, I also murdered your wife. Yeah, where's Lorelai? Your wife? How should I know? Probably somewhere on this rubble. <laughs> no. No, enough delay. This is where it ends. Oh boy. You know, I don't think I am able to bargain. Get it over with then. Gladly. <laughs> so it'll be a better role than you could even hope to be. At Luna Force, at Luna, and this is last loose end. Brood. Wow. Their axe rises into the sky, glints in the sunlight, then falls. And I end up partitions into two bits. You know, I'm pretty sure this is kind of the worst ending you could have had in this game. Yeah, yeah I could have either become a vampire or like dream naps, but no. no I, <laughs> I got beheaded. You in, in the process kill your wife and child, oh my god. Yeah. Queen Nuna's dramatic demise passed into Norton legends. Whenever a tyrant rises in the capital, the chiefs smirk and pray to old health. The attempts to woo Scrampton to the coastal cause was doomed to failure. Eventually, the wizard, bored of these mortal quabbles, fed noble patrician Willcraft to a kraken. <laughs> With their plants and tatters, the counts retreated to their castles to brood. Their olive branch was rejected. Their secret, oh, the secret of eternity that had guard for aeons, it would not be so kind again. With their spectacular destruction of the palace, the chiefs quite literally squashed anyone who could claim the throne. Anyone except, of course, Jorah, who was crowned atop a heap of rubble the very next day. But their reign is a story for another time. I mean, I didn't reject it. I got murdered. <laughs> Meanwhile, the council is clapping. We helped you guys enough. I think the northerners will be oh, all right with having us by their side at the very least. Yeah. Queen Luna, that's why it's buried. <laughs> oh. Damn. Oh. Buried in the rubble, then buried in the ground. Yeah, so I'll be gone for about 15 minutes. I don't know about these guys, also, but... Also, I just, I think I know who got away the best in this entire scenario. Franz right. Exactly! Franz Wright! <laughs> Not right. even on the political True winner. game. Which, Killed a French woman and ran away. <laughs> to be fair... Getting rid of a bunch of nobles, having trans right flourish, that's actually pretty all right. <laughs> yeah, it might not have been all right for me, but at least we got trans right. Or your child. <laughs> yeah, my poor child. And my wife. Aww. Yeah. We don't uh, know that your wife is dead. Eh, she's probably say, dead. Probably, I mean, probably, if any yeah. counts were there, we might have whisked her away. Just be like, Lorelai, your escapade was... <laughs> Pathetic and miserable, but let's get you out of here alive. It's fine, Will. You just got fed to a Kraken. Could be worse. Uh, right? Happy birthday, Luna. All the best to you. It's been a pleasure to find you. You're a very pleasant person and a positive experience every day. Oh, thank you, Ron. And thank Aww. you for stopping by. I really appreciate it. Um, will there be a time to show Portrait. birthday presents, Luna? So what I'm going to do, I'll be gone for 15 minutes to eat lunch. And then after I get back, we'll do presents if there are any. Um, and then we'll probably do another round of King of the Castle. Uh, does that sound good to everyone? I'm up for it. Yeah, yeah so okay. I'll be taking a 15 minute break. There will be some ads so we don't have to deal with them for a while. I These guys will eat too. And uh, we'll all reconvene for, for presents and, and more throwing me in the river, probably. <laughs> See y'all in a bit. Like it, I did it up. Like it.